Hello. Hello, everybody. We are back. We're back again. Once again, as the music stops just in time. There it goes. We are back um, with the Nephi for season three. We... Oh, goodness me. We've done a lot since last time. Um, i got to say, there's been a lot going on. Uh, obviously, last time, if you'd missed out, we uh, finished in the league uh, in fourth. In fourth position. I'll, I'll quickly just show you. this. We haven't started the league, so it's fine. Uh, we finished in fourth, incredibly, above both Port Tower and Athen Lido. So, we have Champions League playoff to play. Uh, to get into the potential Champions League. And if we lose, we're in the Europa League. So it is a win-win. Carmathan and Bala went down. Uh, hello, Viva. CL when? Well, potentially today. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Um, well, not uh, the Champions League win. Champions League content maybe today. Um, but uh, yeah, we've, we've got some games to play. We can, we can potentially, hilariously, you could win the Champions League this year if we qualify, but I don't think it's going to happen. Uh, we also got the new tactic, which is this this beauty uh, of a 3-2-3-2 three, two, three, two DM special. So I've had to go out and sign some players, mainly wingers. Hello, Duck God. Yes, second. Viva got first. Ooh, I like that. It is something. It is something. So we hilariously, we keep a, a good bit of the, the formation, really. We just push the wing, the, the fullbacks up, and we drop the centre mids down. So hopefully hopefully isn't too bad um this is what i'm running with at the moment but we've had to make lots of transfers of course so what happened on the outs we had a couple outs we had uh Yavorovic, he went to convy uh yeah but that changes quite a lot of the dynamics of it it does it does but i'm just hoping that you know you just let him play the similar positions you know <laughs> you let him play and, and see how things go but yeah Yamarovic signed for a free 275k uh Valenzas also left for 1.4 million uh barely played last year got him on a free love lovely stuff Tom Pentra get get him there uh released a few players and we actually released Jacob Rasmussen uh he's gone to Goitra and that's because we brought in a new Danish player got him on a free he played his part he was on 20 pounds a week you know uh and then we also sold Lundin for 235k we're not playing left backs, and he wasn't the best left back anyway. So he goes to Bala for 235k. On the ins, we have brought in a good number of players, as you can see. Hilariously, after a day and a half of playtime, I'm still in November. Jesus, all of this done was done on Saturday night after the stream finished because I was staying up to pick up Chloe from. Uh, she was out with some friends, so I was playing this until about four in the morning. Um, <laughs> so it might be a little. We might have had sleep-deprived Alex with a few of these signings, but I think most of them are good. We, we have had to sadly break the wage budget structure a bit. Uh, but here first up is Eric Meyer. This guy we've been looking at for a long time. He is an attacking midfielder slash striker. Uh, Swiss, um, as you want to see, it's 7k a week. Quite a lot for us, but he's going to be playing striker for us this year. Very good youngster. I hope we can get some good uh, stuff from him. He was doing very well for grasshoppers uh, in the Swiss League. Uh, then first, next up is Boschan. Uh, Kosanyek from Shopper, Sh uh, who's a Slovenian right mid, because we need right mids. FM in the middle of the night can be both beautiful. And exactly. It's when you wake up in the morning and you're just like, oh God, what happened? Thank God I wasn't drunk. If I, like drunk late night FM is the most dangerous, because sometimes you make those signings and you're like, this is a fantastic idea. And the next morning you're just like, what the hell's happened? Um... But yeah, we signed him. He's honestly very good. What the fuck did I do? Exactly. I did so many. There's hilariously what I used to do back when I did this save as a YouTube save back in like 2015. I would get in from a night out and record a video of me playing like the Champions League semi-finals or something. And you can definitely tell which ones are drunk because there's a tiny little slur in my voice if you go back and listen to them. But I did like a, probably a good six or seven review like episodes just ab like after like four in the morning after a night out. Like, <laughs> it was ridiculous. Um, but yeah, he looks very good. 21 year old Slovenian already playing for the national team. Um, yeah, he's going to be hopefully good. And can also play centre mid. And the good thing about him, plays a lot of position. So if formations change, he can still re be relevant. Uh, next up was Radovan Kovacic, who is another right midder. Can also play striker. He is Slovakian. Um, we got him on a free from Trencin. So he's a pretty decent. Then we signed Adnan Pasic from Malmö for 150k. Basically, we had him on a, a three-month, six-month free. But I thought I'd brought him in now. Can play left and right winger. 
His, his uh, technicals look absolutely incredible. Incredible crossing, dribbling, first touch, technique, flair. Looks a very good player there. Uh, as you can see, they're on a lot higher wages. We finally did sign Andy Cameron, by the way, the 31-year-old Scott uh, DM from Celtic. He's a DM, so brought him in after a long time at Celtic, see how he does. Then we signed Daniel uh, Halvorsen, who is a Norwegian left mid, plus winger that has centre mid, uh, playing for the national team already. He looks pretty good. Got him from Stromskod set. Uh, then we signed Abdelight and Gessen, a former Barry player, out for a few uh, uh, weeks, well, a couple of weeks still, but a French internet, well, not French, international French, just a French player. Uh, 19 years old, though, got a good potential on him, so we'll see how he does. Then we've got uh, Hein Paws, who is the reason why Rasmussen left, who is basically we brought in a better young midfielder who was Danish. So he comes in, bit of backup, potential sort of youth uh, there. Uh, so we'll have to see how that goes. Then we signed Alex Mbou, another left winger, a Cameroonian left winger. Uh, basically, we got, like, we got a lot of cover now. I, I kind of went a bit crazy. And then Michael Yedlicka, who is a Czech centre-back, uh, got him from uh, Victoria Pleasant. So that is the signings. Obviously, our wages have gone up a good bit now. As you can see, we've got players on 9k a week. We do have a Cunha for another year. We're training him to play right mid because he's very, very good. Uh, we also have Lockwood this year as well, who can also play centre mid. Training him to play DM as well. Um, otherwise, I think most of the players say the same. Steve Marriott is wanted. I need to sell you, fella. Come on. Yes, yeah, someone someone wants him. Convy want him. Sell him. Um, but yeah. Poor Jed. <laughs> Why poor Jed? Uh... <laughs> Jed <Licker. laughs> um, but yeah, that is the squad we're looking at. Uh, we've been doing a lot of friendlies, of course. Um, some good, some bad. Uh, trying to get this formation to work at the moment. This is what it's looking like. We're midfielders, DM, rolling. I've, I've sort of got two. I've got a defensive one and a more offensive one. Maybe he doesn't want licking. <laughs> That's very true. Um, but yeah, this is how things have been going. We do have the Champions League best playoff draw today, which is what we're going to be in. Uh, I've had a look at the draw, and I'm not very excited, honestly. Um, so we are a non-seeded because uh, we have we have 18 <laughs> we have 18 coefficient. Oh, you can't really see it at the moment. Can I get rid of the? Can't get rid of that. Oh well, it's all right. I, I can hold on. Um, where's the follower group? There, there you go. <laughs> We've got 18 coefficients, so we're the, literally the worst squad here. But we can face Juventus. Fenerbahce, Stoke, FC Ists, or Valladolid. So I'm not looking forward to this, but let's go. Let's draw a team. We've got Juventus out first. CSK Moscow. Oh, us first. There we go. We're home. Who are we going to face? FC Ists. Oh, the French team as well. So, of course, if we fuck up, French get extra. Kofinch, Twente, Stoke, Braga, Fenerbahce, and Standard, Valladolid. Okay. Well, there's our first Champions League games right after the Premier League Cup first round draw. Um, we've got Seth and Dridd, which should be a nice opener for us. We've got Newtown, followed by Goitra, Tom Pendra. And then we've got a run of death of Lido, Barry, Aberwispers, Penny Bond, Port Talbot, Havoth West. So we literally have the big six in a row. And we have the exact same thing in the second half of the season. So hopefully we don't get sacked. Um, yeah, we'll see. 2100. Nice. Stuck on flying along. Um, but yeah, that's how things have been going. Um, I did something I bloody noticed, actually. This is ridiculous. Barry are, are, are pissing me off, man. So they sold Bonomelli, actually, to Port Talbot there. Uh, and they signed Amrani, who's their new star signing. 21 years old, Belgian wonder kid striker. Looks extremely good, to be honest. However, what's been pissing me off is this. Abad Abdenor Derek Dow signed from Lido. They sold him to Lido for 19 million the season before. And I've just bought him back because they've realized they've got no center backs left. Um... They also saw Darren Watts. Um, well, they, did they sign? They signed someone else as well. I think. I swear. Oh, they were uh, they were looking to sign Wolford Ruby. They've been signing a few players here and there. They, they sold another centre back, Leon Walters. I, they just I don't know what their thing is with centre backs on 15, 15 holiday. Yeah, you know I, I assume so. But that's awesome, man. Thank you. Um, but yeah, that is how things are going. So we're just going to continue, I guess. We've got we've still got a friendly to play. Um, and then we're into uh, did they play less to get him back? They did technically play less. Yes, so they, they, they gained 5 million out of it, but I just don't understand why. Like, they sold all their good defenders just to, to buy shit ones for a year or two and then bring back the youngsters when you could have just played the youngsters. Doesn't make sense. Um, 
Happy 300 years, by the way. Yes, this is our this is our 300th season in FM. Once we finish it, we'll we'll have done 300 years, which is awesome. Oh no! What Vasilimilic Gurgic? Wait, what? Oh, this is remember. So this is the guy we tried to sign from Hadrick. We went to Bordeaux, and now he's just transferred to FC. Is who are about to play? Oh, that sucks. This was a really really good guy that I wanted to sign, and we just couldn't couldn't offer him the money. Oh, that's annoying. No offers for Maria. Interesting. We will um, list him for a bit lower then. Oh, yeah. Also, I need to look. We have a bit of an issue with fullbacks now because we, we don't play fullbacks. So people like Lieber and Seema and stuff, I'm going to try and loan out this year. because I don't want to sell them because I think we probably will have them next year again. But I'm going to try and loan them out. Even Julius and I need you to learn to play like left. He's learning to play left mid. Can we, Maybe he's, he's centre back better, you know. What is cent is centre back better for you? Mm. I think he's probably better suited to a left mid, you know. Make him a, a winger, like a wide midfielder. Hold on, left mid, wide midfielder. Yeah, I think that's better suited. <clears throat> is it not even? It's not even thirty megabytes yet. Your save. Wow, three hundred megabytes. That's interesting. I guess. Well, I guess to be fair, 300, not even 300 times three, which is what I'm at, is 900. I'm at about 800,000. So, you know, it, it it works, I guess. I think. <laughs> I think. Um, right. So, let's continue, though. We've got we got another room friendly to go. Convy offer for Lieber. That's good. We can loan him for the season to them. Just just because, like, he's not going to play. He's not going to play this year. And he's going to get pissed at us. So, just try and get him some, some game time out while we can. Okay, numbers. Just submit. But, yeah. So, this is the... the, the I'm in 2023. Hey, nice Viva. Who, who are you managing at the moment? Is, is it the new, new... Is this 24 or 23? Either. How was everyone's weekend, by the way? Mine was very good, actually. After the, well, I, I, to be honest, I had a very late uh, line on on Sunday because I went to sleep at about five a.m. Um, after doing this and picking Chloe up. Uh, but then we watched the um, watched the, the the Vegas GP, which was actually good. Who would have thought? My good God, it was actually a good race. Wow! And fucking Verstappen still won. Um, and then we watched the NFL, which was pretty good as well. And the Dolphins won for Chloe. And Matt kind of got fired from the Steelers, which is amazing. Arby Bragantino trying to do a tour of all the Red Bull clubs. Oh, do you have um, Janino Capi, Capi Zappa on your team? Capi Zappa, I think his name is. He's like a fullback slash centre back. He's very good. What? Sorry, Olivia. I was. Oh my god. This is what I'm talking about. The centre back. I do left back. I I had his uh, card on so rare. He was really. He's really really good in like for Bragantino at least in so rare scoring. So he gets really high up to scores and stuff like that. See, look at this. Sold him for twenty six. Signed him back for twenty million. What is what is wrong with it, Barry? Why are they signing all their former centre backs? Oh, okay. Well then, we continue though. We'll see. We got. We got. A nice, nice, nice start with with the cup and the league games, and then it gets very difficult very quickly. So we have to see how things go. But we are guaranteed Europe, even if we lose this Champions League playoff. Wonder Kid City over there, and I started in real world. There are about seventy eight to eighty chances in and out. Oh God, Jesus! Yeah, I can imagine. A very different style of of uh, managing. Okay, Dazzler's made to room miss chances. I'm trying to sign Decore here, but I think I pissed him off last time I talked to him. But yeah, I did. Because uh, you kind of want to sign the young young players. Oh fuck! Okay, shit. We got no. This is not going to go well because <laughs> because we don't have any homegrown players because they're all new. This is not this is not looking good, you know. Shit. Okay, auto select. Like we don't have Chirillo. Oh my god, these guys aren't going to include. Okay, right. We got to we got to sort this out. We got to. We don't need that that many goalkeepers. We don't need that many goalkeepers. We need centre. We need we need centre backs. We need centre backs. Get rid of you two. We need Mir. We Julius and I'm sorry, mate. You can't come. Um, we need Gronsberg. We want to like we we need we need five centre backs at least because we have got three centre backs. DMs. No, that's fine. We're gonna we're not, not, not gonna have Sorensen or Perif, It seems. Um, oh God. 
Pause. I'm sorry, mate. You're not going to come. And Gessen. Kovacic and Boo. Like, get rid of you, maybe. Kovacic. Oh, good God. Oh, good God. Right. Right side. We got two. Two on the right. Two on the left. And a, and a, and, and a Nara there. What's the striker situation looking like? Steve Marriott, get out of here, mate. Um... We aren't Klaus in. I need, I need two spaces. I lost some once. So I'm fair enough. Fair enough. Getting used to it still, though. Oh, Jesus. Dunchic as well is, is not going to be happy with us. I might loan him out as well this year because I don't think he's going to get game time. Um, fuck. <laughs> We've got no... Like, we, we literally need to get rid of two of these players because they, we can't get rid of these guys because these guys are just homegrown guys. So it doesn't matter. I need because we need basically minimum of eight players trained there. We just don't have that time at the moment. I could get rid of Doyle. The Doyle, wait, Doyle is homegrown. Oh no, Doyle's fine. So I can get rid of Shane Doyle. And I need to get rid of one more. I guess you go Kovacic. <sighs> this is uh, so maybe we've been the CL on the, the Champions League squadron. We got to have half of our players. Ferguson's not even there. Like, he's injured at the moment, so he's not in the squad. Like, oh, Jesus, man. This is not this is not what you want, you know? Al Vorsen, Kostanek, Nara, Andy Cameron, and Gessen. We can play DM and CM. Right, I, just go with this for the moment. Like, fuck it out. Like, Frank Ferguson's out. Juliusen, Train, Duncic, and Boo, Seema, Kovacic. Lieber, Matt. oh god, there's so many players that aren't gonna are gonna be so pissed at me. Oh god, right, we try and sell uh, Lat Marky as well. There's gonna be so many people pissed at me. Like we just can't have a squad because we have no youngsters because we're so new. Like all the players. Oh yeah, Juliusen's unhappy. I'm sorry, Juliusen. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You, look, you're going out on loan, mate. Okay, well, of course the one that's going out on loan is happy. You know. <sighs> Not gonna, be, not gonna be a good time, lads. Not gonna be a good time. <laughs> yeah, our squad's gonna be so thin in the Champions League, man. Give it a couple years and maybe and we'll have like homegrown players, but like, oh goodness. Okay, Lieber's off to Convy at least. At least he's gonna get some game time this year. I'm tempted to even loan Juliusen out just to see if he can get some time. We got a couple days until our first game here versus Stefan Dridge, but they're non league, so you'd hope. You'd hope that we could beat them. But to be fair, this is the first time we're actually gonna play with the squad the, the um the tactic. So hopefully it works. Otherwise, we're going to be back to the drawing board a little bit here, you know? Um, right. Du, 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 du. Anything of interest? Reynolds. There's no offers for two players. Fuck. All right. Yeah, I've been doing a lot of scouting. A lot of scouting for players this off-season. Well, it basically in just one night, I did a lot of scouting. Um, I, am I scouting these guys? Are these guys up for scout? Let me scout these guys. There we go. Lanzado, you're a winger. Javier Silver. I don't know. Okay, well we, we just we just we just go. <laughs> we start the season. You know? It's this is this is one of the things of this, this formation, because sometimes some of your key players, like Julius and absolute key player last year, not gonna be not gonna be played this year, like at all. And so you've got to basically have these players training different different formation play positions so often to to be able to play, which is why I, I quite like the signings of um, like Passic and Kostanek and Halvorsen because they can play four positions already and you can train them to more positions. Like I probably will train him to be a, a right midfielder here. Uh, Passic, maybe I'll train you to be a uh, right winger. Um, Halvorsen, you can be a right mid. Yeah, he's, oh, yeah I've already done that. Um, Kostanek. Left mid. Yeah, he's already training left mid. So we'll see how this goes. Um, I feel like the training position was easier on this FM than it is now. Probably, yeah. I, I, I do hear that I think that it takes away some potential from the player, but I'd rather have the flexibility, you know? Um, especially in this this version. But yeah, I think it was a lot easier. Like, a lot of these players I started at, like, it... Um, oh, Barry lift the Super Cup versus Galatasaray. Lovely to see. Good stuff for the coefficient, at least. Um... I think like a lot of these players, I started them tr their training like before the window start, like before the, the summer window started. So players like Anat was on a DM already. Um, who else here? 
like Pet if I trained him to be a DM. Like it's it's yeah. We've got we got a, we got a bit of a bloated squad to be fair. Um, so it's gonna be a bit. Of, we're gonna have a few people pissed at us. I feel this season. But that's we're gonna have to put up with that, you know. See so who works, who doesn't. Um, but we will see. Oh, the people are tired. Shit, forgot. Players are tired still. Um, okay, any players here that we can actually sign for any decent money? You know, one point two. No. Mm. You, Lanzado, you're two point two million for a full back, so we don't need you this year, mate. Rob Sa Saker, two point eight million. Three point. Oh, this is the guy that rejected us for the loan. Fifty percent, seven thousand. Would he actually want to join? We don't. We don't need more players really this year. I would say. Oh, pins on. He's up for sale. Can I loan you? No. Santiago. <laughs> Can I loan you? Like, it'd be funny if I could just loan a couple of these guys, like really like high quality guys, because they're on transfer list. But no, it doesn't seem like it. Right, game day. Let's go. Cup game. First knockout round of the cup. I hope we win. We're at home as well, so best best setting for us. And then we got Champions League straight after. So let's see uh, how things go. Salagi bid, okay, right. Let's continue. Come on. Let's see. Hmm, match preview teams. So let's let's do a quick pick. See what the team selects. Okay, they want Halvorsen. They want Cameron Sorensen, Chris and Mir, Kirilla, Costa next. Fent Klaus and Malasevich, Lockwood in that role there. Doyle, Acuna, Paws, Maya, and Juliusson. You're not going to be needed on the bench, mate. Um, we've got a striker, a centre mid, and a right winger. Striker, a centre mid, and a right winger. We need a centre back, really. Train, maybe. Gronsberg, maybe Gronsberg. I like Passage though on the on the instead of Acuna, honestly, because he can play both wings. Because then we got centre mid, both wings, stri striker, and centre back, and goalkeeper. Realistically, I don't think we need the goalkeeper. Um, so maybe we put someone like. Who do I want to get get off to a good start, you know? Maybe... Oh, we got the youngsters as well. Um, maybe we do, like... Do I swap those over? No, I'll swap those over like that. Maybe I'll look at another sentiment. I, and no, I would have put a Nar in, but he's not injured. He's uh, injured at the moment. Paris travelling. Um, Dunchich. Gasson's also injured. Mekanovic, I guess. Right, let's go. A few squad numbers be given out. <laughs> a good few, actually. Oh, Hal Lawson does get 11, though. And right, we're going to see if this works or not. Uh, we were, oh, we were in, obviously, we were in the Champions League, weren't we, last time? So, uh, 2D Classic. They are 50 to 1. So, hello, John. Hello. How are you, mate? How's it going? You join us for our first game of the night with the new formation. Uh, the 3-2-3-2 three, two, three, two DM. But let's see how things go. This is the more attacking version of it, I think. So we'll have to see how things... Oh, Lockwood hits the bar from the start. But we also um, get a... Uh, what's it called? Offside called. Sorensen, Cameron, Demalasevich, Halvorsen. Back to Malasevich. Oh, it's a good strike. It's a clear-cut chance straight away. Uh, however, you can't really call any of this because this is a non-league team. So this is, I guess, more of a... Hopefully, like, it's competent enough to get a good win here, you know? Oh, oh, Klaus, mate. How's that not gone in? We are very much on top early here, but I guess... Why is Chirilli taking a corner? Why is our centre-back taking a corner? That's a bit of an odd one. Cameron, mate. I don't think Chirilli's getting to there. Are you a legend at all the clubs you've managed? Not at Thanethi yet, but yes, I am a, a, a legend at all of them, which is how I get my name uh, on the stadium. You can only get that if you are a legend of the club. So I am a legend at five clubs currently, and we're looking to make it a sixth at the moment. Kostanek. Oh, mate, that's poor. Poor. Way wide. We are very much on top here. I would like a goal, though, lads. Um, Cameron. Kostanek. Back to Cameron. Sorensen. Sorensen tries to get it through Klaus. Ackle, Kostanek, can he play him back in? Oh, he's beating his man, and he's hit the post. Kostanek, mate. If you could finish a bit better, maybe we'd be up by now, which is worrying. I, I'm, I, the, him, he's getting a lot of space on that right right side, you know. Okay, we've lost the ball here. Don't concede. Boys, for God's sake. It's, it's fucking seven druids. They don't even play league football. More on the ball for them. 
Can we win the ball here? No, Jenkins. Oh, this is not looking good. <laughs> okay, Lockwood comes in. Well done, Lockwood. Lockwood down the left into Malasevich. Had a good season last year. Tries to play a, a ball in. It was terrible. And Sorensen. Oh, my days. Good. Well, that's a nice way to start the season, isn't it? Bloody hell. What a strike. It just falls to him from the clearance. One touch to take it down. Boom. Look at that. One nil. Love to see it. Hopefully that that opens the uh, the door a little bit, you know, as Hal Vorson puts a free kick wide. Af and Leader are playing in this round. Oh, Milosevic scoring for Milosevic for Newtown. He's he's been that it's gonna be a legend for them in no time. Malasevich comes forward for us though. Malasevich forces Harding to get a save there. Carilla plays it in. You should not be taking corners. Right. Set pieces. <laughs> Set pieces. Corners. Pass it. Okay. Kostanek, why are you not taking... Like, realistically, it should be this. Hold on. Like, you're very good. Pass it. Pass it. Pass it. Okay. Apparently, he can't take it because he's on the bench. Why? There we go. Right. Hello, Tommy. Afternoon, Shabalala. Hello. How are you, Tommy? You join us for our first game of the season with our new new team formation, new team. Oh, good save there. We are very much on top here. It's a matter of actually just getting some, some actual shots on target properly because we've had five clear-cut chances and only one nil up is a bit of a worry. Sorry, is that makes it six? No, it's still five, technically. Um, yeah, we just haven't been good in front of goal today, annoyingly. We could have been a lot, lot further up, but for some reason... We, we can't score. Sorensen. Oh, for God. Cameron, man. Come on. We need to score. Please, someone. Cameron on the ball again. Sorensen. Lockwood. Oh, my God. He missed. Oh, who scored? Someone scored. Klaus gets his first of the season. Oh, this is more of a season we'll be, we'll be monitoring. How does Lockwood... Oh, it's, it's on the line there. It's just an absolute clusterfuck here. And somehow, Klaus just puts it into the bag. Can I redeem hot sauce, hot sauce shot? No, you can't, Tommy. Hello, Nizzy. Hello. How are you? You join us for halfway through our first game where we are missing lots and lots of chances, but it's but it's uh, non-league, so it's okay. Um, but we're just... This is this is a, a nice little, like, just make sure we can... <laughs> I forgot about the sound for that one, but I've got my water with me. Hot sauce, please. No. <laughs> Not doing hot sauce today. That's saved for other for special times. <laughs> okay, Klaus Kostanek. Wow. Hello, Ardy. Hello. How are you? Going with the uh, Kimi Raikkonen. How are you, Ardy? It's been a while, man. Oh, Lockwood. That's a proper. Oh my goodness. Lovely stuff from Lockwood. Second second year on loan for us. What a strike. Sadly, it's been taking taking long long range strikes for us to actually get get ahead in this game and a shoddy goal. We've had seven clear cut chances. Oh my god! How is everybody coming in now? Um, I was talking already. I had a good weekend. Speaking of Kimmy, I do not have the drink. <laughs> oh no! Oh no, Ardy. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. It's been a while, man. It's been it's been a while. All right, Maris goes long. We, we're into our third season with Thanethi now, where we're playing uh, this formation. As Chris Ann's injured already, which is not good. Um, we have Thanksgiving here in the States. Oh, yes, I heard. Well, there's the Thanksgiving football, of course. And they've got the Black Friday uh, football as well with the Dolphins playing. Me and Chloe watched on the, the Dolphins win again on, on Sunday. But although it was a bit of a crazy, crazy game uh, elsewhere. Um, you, are you doing anything for Thanksgiving, Ardy? Are you going back to family? Um, I assume you would be home already, I guess. Indeed. Um... But yeah, we also watched the F1. Nizzy, did you, what did you think of the Vegas GP? Me and Chloe thought it was very good, actually. Probably one of the better races of the season, you would say. Just due to the amount of actual overtakes and fights for the league. And the sad thing is Verstappen still wins. I'm home, got Turkey. Hey, nice. Too bad both uh, New York American football teams are not having a... Yeah, they're really... Like the, is it Tim Boyle starting for the Jets on on uh, on the ne next week? Which is, which is really not good. Like, he wasn't even good at college level, man. It's, oof, it's not looking good, man. Not looking good. Oh, Sorensen. Sorensen. Lovely stuff. 4 nil. I've, I've bought some stuff. I bought a new Hoover during Black Friday week. Well, it's Black Week, isn't it now? It's called, that's what it's called in, in, it's called. in Sweden, it's called Black Week, which is 
Um, but I bought a Hoover. I'm very adult now. I also bought a new hard drive for FM saves. <laughs> and some a sniffing mats for Ving to keep her occupied. And a HDMI cable because I went broke. Well, it's not breaking, but it keeps flickering. Um, this this game is pretty much like, you know, a, a, a foregone conclusion, I think. I got up early for it, fell asleep. F1 just bores me. And then went to football and got a 10-0 win. Nice. Me and Chloe didn't watch it live because... I what happened ended up happening was Chloe was out until about four, so I I was up all night doing all the transfers for this season, which is probably why there's a few wild ones in there. Um, and then I picked her up and we went to bed at five a.m. and I went, I'm not getting up for a seven a.m. race. By the way, Malasevich for the goal. Uh, so we went to sleep and we watched it at like one p.m. The Norwegian commenter called it the best race he'd ever seen after half of it. Lol, <laughs> that's that's a bit. That's a little bit uh, hyperbolic, you'd say. I'd definitely say it's it's probably up there for race of the season, for sure. I saw it had 99 overtakes, which is the most since um, China in the dry, I think, in 2016. I saw a stat, and Hamilton had 15. So I, I do think, like, the 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 straights were just, a, a, like, maybe there's a little bit of tweaking, but they were a good level. Like, teams weren't sailing past every time. Sometimes they would. But that I means they had a good exit. Like, you had to have a good exit. And then also, sometimes you have to be better on the brakes, you know. So, I think it went, the race went pretty well, honestly. Just Verstappen winning again, of course. Uh, been on our following F1. Got kind of bored once I realized. Yeah, exactly. that's very true. Uh, understandable, Ardy. Completely understandable. Um, <laughs> completely, mate. Like, it's every... Thank God this year, this week's the last week. But to be honest, it's going to be the exact same next year, isn't it? It's just going to be like, oh, well, the Red Bull are, are suddenly four seconds quick again because they started development on this car uh, halfway through the last season while everyone was still making their other car. It's not going to change till 2026. The rest wasn't as powerful. So, yeah, exactly. Like I think the drivers wanted it to be longer, but it's just it's just not long enough. So that either they had to have a really good exit, or they had to be late on the brakes, which is makes for good racing because it's like oh, it's not easy to overtake. You actually have to have some effort. Unlike Verstappen, who off the first corner just drives off the track again, which is like oh, I was like oh, this is like that Verstappen I saw when he was facing Hamilton, you know. And then the fact that it, was, it wasn't even a give back, it was a five second. I'm like, well, that doesn't mean much, does it? You know, a give back the place is a bit more sort of uh, damaging. But five second, the Red Bull can. It was interesting though the the, the ebbs and flows of Verstappen sort of and Leclerc. Well, the, the Ferraris and the Red Bulls like one's faster and then the other's faster. And then the last last lap overtake from Leclerc on Perez was incredible. Imagine if um, if that had been for the lead. Oh, God, you can only imagine. Um, I don't even think he meant it. Probably not, honestly. But at the same time, it's still like... I think everybody's tires were a bit cold. There was a bit, there was a lot of stuff going on, but it's like still like, come on, man. And the and Red Bull like, oh, we didn't do anything wrong. I was like, come on, you, you drove him off the road. <laughs> he couldn't make the corner there. But for, uh, for Leclerc, yet again with a shit start. Like, is, is name, name a better duo of all time of Leclerc, Pole, Verstappen, win, man. What's new? Um, well, we're, we're in third season. New, new, uh, new. Formation that's doing pretty well. Um, we, uh, what's that? Ving, hopefully, will be getting her staples out from her surgery uh, this week. She's been doing pretty okay. It's got very, very cold here. Uh, it was minus 25, 26 today, and like felt like minus 31. Well, it's minus 25 at 5 30. Let's check what the time is now. It's supposed to snow tomorrow, um, so we'll see. Hold on, sorry. It's been some very cold dog walks at the moment. It's minus 23 currently, so it's got a bit warmer, actually. Um, feels like minus 31, though, so that hasn't changed. <laughs> so, yeah, it's it's very, very, very cold currently. Um, okay. Spade. Uh, my dog got neutered two weeks in got staples. No, no, she had to have a surgery to... Um... Oh, goodness, we don't have any DMs. Um... So you had to have surgery to take out a, a, a mass in her stomach. They're checking to see if it's like cancerous or something. So uh, she she's uh, like not been cut, or not been spayed at all. She's an older dog, which sometimes happens with them. So um, win the league. No, sadly not. I hope you mean Fahrenheit. No, Celsius. Celsius. 
Um, oof. Yo, hello, Sister Sinistech. How are you? Um, who else do I want to play? I want let's let's give Maya his his debut. Um, yeah, have him in the kind of complete forward role. Um, just two. Let's bring on Passage as well. Get him in a game. Bring him on for. Oh, I've made all my substitutions. I made Krizan. Yes, that's true. Um, I'm the uh, one using Fahrenheit in this chat. <laughs> Me and only me visiting the motherland this week. Oh, why is that saying a snake? We've got to learn class in 12 minutes. No, no worries, Hardy. Have a good class, mate. <laughs> what? Yes, it's very cold in northern Sweden, Tommy. It's very, very, very cold. Like, uh, uh, you have to scrape your car vigorously and sit there for 20 minutes as it warms up. Um, and then also wear gloves and hat in the car because you've got so... <laughs> it's, it, was, it was cold drive this morning. Which only really today is this week. What, 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 what do you mean, Sinistake? Coldest of the cold. Are you? Yes, we we are a long way above the Arctic Circle uh, in Kirina. Like a good, is it? Are we like seventy kilometers above the Arctic Circle? Hold on, let me check. We're still playing. Hold on, let me pause. Pause the game so I can actually see some goals. Uh, Kirina. How far above the Arctic Circle are we? Um. Arctic. Um, 145 kilometers, so 90 miles above the Arctic Circle. Yes. <clears throat> like the areas that have 23. Yes. No. Oh, yeah. No. The sunrise was about 10, uh, 9 a.m., 9.30 today and set at about maybe 2, 1.30. We're about to get... Oh, a lovely whip penalty win there. Um, and Malasevich is about to get his hat trick. Um, we're about to get, I think, December 13th, December 16th this year. We're going to get full darkness for like, I don't know, uh, two weeks, two and a half weeks. The sun disappeared today for us. Would you, uh, I, thought, I thought you were below me, Viva. Wow, proper northern lights. Yeah, you, know, you can you can see them. Like, but there actually hasn't been that many recently. It's been quite low activity, but we will be seeing them a lot more, yes, because it's going to be dark constantly. Uh, Malasevich. Oh, oh, Chirilla. Eight. We're, we're flying here, but it's it's a non-league team, so I guess you'd expect the win here. Um, but nice for people to get on the score sheets. I'm going to Gdansk on Saturday for a poker Pokemon tournament and then a football match. Nice in a state. That'll be awesome. That'll be awesome, man. Holy shit. I'm way above you. Wait, wait, where are you? I thought you were... What, what, what city are you again? Oh, yeah. I swear. Oh wait, you you you. Yes, no, you are more northern than me, aren't you? Well, I forgot where where you are. Yeah, no, I I do I do remember now, because. Yeah, yeah, you are more northern than me. But yours went today. That's wild. I need pictures of this. <laughs> I've got loads of photos of um. Of the old auroras, like from the previous years. Oh goodness me, be a long way back though. New FM feature, make Arctic Circle games a thing because Smory lives in Kirina. <laughs> well, we do have Kirina, like the team Kirina FF up here, who play, uh, they play the summer months though, so the season's over now. Um, all right, God, I need to go, I need to go back to last year because I don't think I've taken any photos this year of the, the Northern Lights. You kind of get a bit, um, sadly, you get a little bit, uh, Sort of done with, not done with them, but you take them for granted a bit, because <laughs> you're like, oh well, this is like this happens every every day, you know. Um, there's there's one. Hold on, what what, what camera do I need? Uh, big cam. There we go. Like, there's some basic northern lights, you know. That's at work. No, is that work? That's a closed work. Um, yeah, I don't have any other. I don't. I, I think I've moved a lot of my photos actually, so. Yeah, no. Oh, there's one on my Instagram, isn't there? Um, Kieran and the base game. They are, are they now? Oh, I have to. Have to, have to I think they are. Yeah, because Sweden's got all four divisions, don't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kieran and the base game. Um, oh, here we go. This is this is from our first first winter there. That was some very good aurora. You can, oh, you can see it better there without the, the flash. Like it's it's very good, very very good auroras. Like, yeah, it, it was pretty decent, pretty decent aurora, you know. <laughs> right. Um. What am I doing? But, uh, get off that. We won eight nil. Um. Probably novelty wears off. Yeah. They. they uh. I get you're in that bit above. Does above over Sweden. 
<laughs> Look up Karuna and go northwest a bit. <laughs> Kirin is the coast compared to, to Viva. <laughs> Kieran is in the middle. We're 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 very away from all the coasts you can get. We're pretty much mo like in like very very centered. We have lots of lakes though. I get FM next year and I have time. Maybe I should just do a Kieran essay. Maybe only sign players from Norland. You know <laughs> the county. Wow, Mrs. C has always wanted to see see it. Honestly, like don't do not pay for those Northern Lights tours because like realistically, it's. All you're paying for is just them having a car. So, like, if you're going to rent a car, you can just go drive out yourself, use a map, like one of those Aurora maps, and go follow it. FM Llama is doing... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember you saying, Beaver. Um, I still haven't checked that. I need to. Sounds good. Um, but, uh, yeah, no. Like, it's one of those things, like, if you have, like when you're... If you have something nearby... Oh, we got t TV coverage. Only 12K. Human. Um... You kind of just take advantage of it. You're like, well, it's there, so why, 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 you know? It's, we're like, when we go out, we're like, oh, there's some Northern Lights. And we're like, we're not going to go out, like, get ready and go out and look at them because they're not that powerful. When we were first here every night, we were like, let's go check. Let's just go check, even if there's like a 5% chance. Um, and sometimes it's so quick, like, there's five minutes, we'll, we'll go by and it'll be like, oh, yeah, it's, they're gone now, you know? It's, it's, it's um, very, very temperamental. But trying to see Northern Lights is genuinely, if you just go to a, like a place in Northern Sweden and Nor Norway for a week and then hope for the best, because it's all chance, really. Any United Liverpool fans? Hello, Eldon. Hello. How are you? Um, what am I doing? Yes, that's a good start. We've got Champions League now. And then we've got Newtown in the middle of it. Um, squad, what was I supposed to be doing here? Reserves. Yeah, as far from any light position. Exactly, that's very true. There's a good thing about Kieran. It's not that good. like it's very easy just to get out of this the main area and, and just go. Um, so, it, yeah. Now they're banned. <laughs> no, they're not banned. They're not banned. Fancy's here. He's not. Well, he's not here. But Fancy's allowed in. You know. <laughs> and 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 Black Arrow. She's Liverpool. Um, okay, right. Just scouting. Let's go. Hope not, log, because I have to something to advertise with Smory's permission. They're not invited. Sure, Eldon. What what is it that you want to advertise? I, this is I'm like intrigued. How much do you charge for a room? <laughs> Sadly, we don't. We we only have the one room, so <laughs> there uh, there is no extra room here. But uh, this okay. We're gonna add to the shortlist. Oh wait, hold on. Let's. Get rid of all this. I want to. Uh, it's really annoying because of the way my shortlist works. I'm having to like scouting transfer. I want to put them on the list. No. Cool. I can I only do like lists. Add to shortlist default indefinitely. Oh, this is annoying. I'll sleep in the bathtub. We don't have a bathtub. <laughs> That's even, it's, I can tell, see, I can tell you, like, it's just not, there, there is, there's a good few hotels up here, to be fair. Although some of them, some of them are a bit expensive. The clothes work is expensive. Like, it's crazy what some people will spend up here. Like, Chloe, like, has, a, has, a, like, she works at, like, cabins and stuff, you know, um, like, uh, just, like, log cabins in, in the woods and stuff. Um, and then they have like, oh, you can do tours, you can do a snowmobile tour, you can do sled dog tours, like we'll set it up for you, blah, 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 blah. And some people, they'll, they'll come up for like four, five days and they'll be like, it's like five grand. And I'm like, holy fucking shit, that's so expensive for like what it is. Like I know it's a lot, a lot of it's cool, but like it's so much money. It's so much money for, for like what you could get elsewhere, you know, um, it's crazy. Right, um, let's see. My club are running a fundraiser where you can get a travel plus stay plus match day paid experience for two in March for the Liverpool United game. Oh, wow, that's awesome. That's pretty cool. We'll put the link in, Eldon. I don't think I, I, I don't think the, the travel bit would count from Kirina, I assume, Eldon. <laughs> How on earth did you end up living here? PhD, PhD program. There you go, as Ali says. Uh, there's a ton of higher end cabins popping up now. The thing is, though, the, the, the cabins, they, 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 like, like, have aren't high end. Like they're deep. Like I've been in one. It was 
we got like cheap um for, but they're not high end they do have the high end ones they've got like the aurora ones which are like the glass ones they're super nice but most they're just wood, it's just because there's not many places that have it so they can rack the prices up loads like they make shit tons um once in a lifetime kind of stuff though to so that's very true exactly that's very true it's one of those things it's like when when we came like when i got offered it was like well it's like a once in a lifetime thing you're gonna go live there you know so but now you're here you're like you kind of just take it for granted um but yeah um higher end do you mean higher end is higher north? <laughs> it's not a link I have to be contacted. And I have to hand write the raffle. Oh, okay. Well, if any of you are interested in that, message Eldon. Uh, put it in the Discord if you want as well, Eldon, to, to let the people in Discord that might not be in the stream. Oh, of course we get Barry in the second round. For fuck's sake, lads. Well, that's us out of the cup. God damn it. Right, well, that's not, that's not what we wanted to see. It is 10 euro per ticket. Oh, okay. Yeah, I feel like you'd probably lose a lot of money if I won that. Spent trying to get me traveling from Kirina. <laughs> uh, that'd be something. <laughs> to pay 10 euros to get a flight from Kirina to, to Manchester. Uh, is it Manchester or Liverpool for the, for the game? So we can scarf our classes as a hot summer holiday for you. <laughs> well, the thing is, though, in the summer here, it gets warm. Like, it gets up to, like, 30 degrees. Oh, hold on. What? They're all poaching Dylan Daniels, the West Ham manager. So he's just won the Prem and now, wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, ma manager move, no, staff. Job security. They still haven't, ha when did, when did they sack their managers? Paul Tabber, Penny Bond and Afanu still don't have managers. Um, I'll wait until Friday to ask the chairman if we are going to set outside UK and Ireland. Makes sense, Elder. Makes sense. I, 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 <laughs> our summer trip to Spain was always a drive to Pitti Hallulia. <laughs> That's amazing. That is amazing. The, the Venice of the North, Lulia, you know? I assume it's the summer. It's the opposite. Yeah, 24. 24 hours. I think, for, for us at least, in Kirina, we have about a month and a half? 40 days, I think it is. 40 days of all sun. No, no going out. So you have to board up the windows and stuff. When did they lose their manager? I swear Port Tabot lost their manager ages ago. Yeah, they left in March. Why is... Why did they... Have they not got a new manager? They've been without a manager for the, the entire summer. What is wrong with them? Hold on. What did Daphne Lido do? When did Daphne Lido lose their manager? February? February? Jesus Christ. Why are these people not managing their teams? Averford West? Was it oh was it Penny Bond or Averford West? No, Averford West he's still there. So did no. Vanessa. Was it Penny Bond then? Newtown. Penny Bond. May. Okay, Penny Bond. But like, why have they not I got managers? Um fuck. Ends up like a disheveled pigeon. <laughs> <laughs> like it's it, it honest the summer's much better because the summer you can at least control it a bit better where you can just put like blackout curtains up and you can simulate night a lot easier it's a lot harder now because i'm like i'm having lunch at work and i'm like oh well there goes the sun you know like <laughs> even if you have like a half day at work you're leaving in the dark so it's a lot more depressing in this in the winter oh how, how long do you um viva how, how many days of 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 night do you have then at the moment okay so daniels chose penny bond go to work darker fuck we'll finish at work dark as well yeah pretty much at the moment i'm still getting some light uh although it's soon gonna go because i'm leaving at like eight to nine and i think the sun's rising at nine so i'll get a little bit of sun you know a little bit and then the morning i get some sun but that's gonna be gone soon in the next two three weeks right fc ists i don't know how good we're gonna i don't think we're gonna be good at Back in late January for me. Ooh, that is tough, Eva. Like, I thought mine was bad. I think mine's... I think Kieran is like 20 days. 20... I think it's three weeks or something. But that, that yours is a full two and a, two and a half months or so. Like, that is... That's a long, long old time. Sunrise here about 7-ish, but dark about 4.30. Yeah. <laughs> God, I wish it'd be so dark at 4.30. Right, um, there goes the sun, do, 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 do. <laughs> how much sun time you get, um, at the moment, oh yeah, your, your sun time in the, in the summer must be like 
three months as well. Wait, let me just check here right now. Sunrise, sunset. How much did we get today? We had four hours. Up at 9.15, down at 1.30. There you go. Okay. Vestiga. Now it sees it the exact same. Okay. Well then. Um, oh, Kovacic injured. Food poisoning. They're trying to poison us. Okay. You'd love to see it. Um, board. Oh, yeah, we're also getting training facilities and youth facilities it's actually going to be made this time because we have the finances. We've got 10 mil in the bank. You love to see it. Still still running off that Mortensen money, um, which is good. <laughs> right. This is... Uh, it doesn't matter, but I kind of want a good, a good showing anyway. You know, I want us to have a chance going into the second leg, but I don't think we do. I think this is way too early for us. But we did, we have beaten the big Welsh sides and they, like we beat Barry and they won the Champions League. So, you know, like it's one of those like, well, but it's also this formation. We have, this is the first actual big team test of the formation, you know, is it actually going to be any good? Um, oh, 16,500. You love to see it. Okay. Um, it's an assistant. I've got another squad registration. We've already registered the squad once. Annoying. Right. Are you playing with the same manager you started with? Yes. Yes, we are. Um, I started the save with... Oh, well, technically, I started the save with one manager. I simulated for a season until Affenlido got promoted to the top, to the, the Welsh League. And then I um, retired him. And uh, I retired him. And then what's it called? Um, add this new manager. So, yeah. So what, you're 318 years old? Uh, I think it was 1994. So I'm technically 321. Yeah, 321. Um, <laughs> 325. No, 321. I was, I was born 1994 in this save. Yeah, I, the, the Hall of Fame date is broken because of the, the, the sh broken stuff. Um, from, like the save. That, so it says I'm, I was born 2227. But uh, yeah, it's game status shows otherwise you know um i hope that doesn't help hurt, hurt me when i'm trying to submit you know always start you at 25 yeah but uh 94 it was born 1994 so good for your age <laughs> well it doesn't um Four, six. I, I swear, no. My my. Oh, true. You can't start managing younger than twenty-five. I think. Hmm. The game stops counting after hundred. It does. Yes. It resets me, but every once in a while, back to uh, seventy-five. Well, what, what age am I now? Seventy-five again. There you go. Born twenty twenty-four. Apparently. It was ninety-six then? Or... It was definitely. I was born in 1994, 1996 On the old like for that manager. So, I don't know. Right, what are they saying? I don't know whether to go with this or go with a little bit more defensive. This. But we are at home. So, maybe we go for this. Lockwood, Anara. They want Anara left mid. Interesting. Uh, Kostanek, Svenningson, Malasevich, Mitch, Kirilla, Krizan, Cameron and Sorensen again. Um, Mikanovic, Maya, Yedlika, Acuna, Halverson, Passage. Pass. No, we leave it for now. Do we need a midfielder, really? Well, we can play centre mid. Um, <clears throat> so 2014, when the save started, would have made you 20 IRL, but FM starts your manager at 25. I, uh, it, I don't know. It was. It always used to say 1994, didn't it, though, on the Hall of Fame? When, like, my manager age. So, I don't know. At this point, who I'm just say 300, you know. <laughs> Is FM24 the lowest age you can start? Is 19 or well born in 04? Oh, okay. Yeah, they, I remember they definitely lowered it once, like for the newer saves. Um, I'll take out Halverson or Perif. And then they can, we have a DM on the bench. Fuck knows. <laughs> exactly. Right. Yeah, look, it gets a number. Let's go. First champ. First Champions League game, you know? Um. First Champions League game with Tanethi. We're favourites? I don't think we're going to be favourites for this game. Oh, Christ. Expect a good result. Come on, lads. 
Keep up the good form, you know. Let's see how this works against a big team, you know. Can it actually work? <laughs> Mir, well done, lad. Kirilla, Inara. Okay, all right. Highlight to them immediately. Not what you want to see. Um... um not what you want to see immediately. Not what you want to see. Not what you want to see immediately. Just, just, just back it up. Back it up, lads. F -f it's not working. It's not working very well at all, has, has it? We're favourites of this game, apparently. They've absolutely just dominated us. And somehow, we sort of, they sort of got three, really. But score direct from a corner. Okay, it's it's all them. It's, it's, it's not going well, lads. It's not going well. It's 2-0. That one a long range strike. It's it's not 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 going well, lads. Like <laughs> not going well. Not the start we wanted, really, you know? Not the start you wanted. Oh, we've got the ball. Can we can we have a highlight maybe? Maybe maybe this is like the, the Horsham game where we start poorly and then get into the game. Oh no, at the back post. How? How favourites. Apparently we're favourites. I don't know. How did Anara not score though, by the way? Okay, maybe we're coming into the game. Maybe we just started slow. 4-2 win incoming lads. No, they, they won the ball again. Oh no, Krizan, get there. Go on, lad. Cross the neck. Go on, play him through. Oh, it's a poor ball. <clears throat> oh fuck. What am I doing? Why am I doing look for overlap on? Get that off. Westman going forwards. Santiago. Rios. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Offside this time. TL win as he said. Look, 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 look. It could happen. We can make the amazing comeback still. It's still technically possible. I just wish Anara scored that goal. Okay, okay, right. I think it's time to switch to the defensive version of it. <laughs> and go standard. Highly structured. And then take off overlaps on. We go defensive wiggers and two DMs. And see if this works. <laughs> See if this is a bit better coping. Cameron free kick. Jesus, Cameron, mate. Why is it? Why are you taking free kicks and not Inara? Right. Well, okay. We've, we've definitely shut up shop a bit better here now. Um, half time. Two nil down. Just absolutely awful. You know, just shockingly bad. But maybe set second half we can. Two nil is the most dangerous scoreline. You know, no, it's the most dangerous scoreline. <laughs> Inara, go on. Uh, early goal. Cross the neck. Play it in. I tried to play it in. Okay, just loses it. Okay, well done, Kostanek. Great, great stuff, fella. Cameron, well done. Sorensen. Another throw to them. Westman. Oh, well done. Oh, nearly. Mm. We might be in trouble a bit this year, you know, lads. Might be in trouble a little bit. <laughs> Who knows, though? Maybe we, we, we could just play, like, non-league teams all year. That'd be great. There's Maris with another great save there. Um, What am I supposed to be doing? What do I want to check? I don't even know. <laughs> Not going well. Just get through the game. Get, get into the Europa League, you know. That's the aim. That was always the aim. Oh, for fuck's sake. Of course. The thing is, though, they have scored off of three set pieces, by the way. So, like, it's not even like we, they, we've been outplayed that badly. It's just that they've scored three set pieces. It's like, for fuck's sake. Like, but this is the home leg. I'm worried about the away leg, you know. <laughs> I'm very worried about the away leg if this is the home leg. <laughs> I just, uh, I don't know, Maris, Inara, fucking hell, Inara, if the players are just getting hit with the ball, you know, oh, go on, send him off, he's just Batista bombed him, referee, they're not even talking, not even a yellow, referee, he's disgusting, he's disgusting, ref, oh, brilliant, love it, love it when your free kicks do that, Mir, go on, lad, actually on the ball, boss the neck, you've been pretty poor today, mate. Can you do any? Oh, we be, to be fair, oh, Lockwood, mate, you've got to be doing better. Malasovic on a, a 6.2. Take him off the pitch from Mikanovic. Don't score another free kick. I, I swear to God, if they just score all of their set pieces. Oh, go on. We've got a chance here. Mikanovic. Oh, how? How has that not gone in? We've had actually had two, like, clear cut, like, chances right in the front. I got on the goalkeeper, saved both of them. Like, the Inara chance and then that chance. Like, how? Oh, very annoying. We could technically be 3-2 losers at the moment rather than 3-0, which would be a lot nicer to see. Oh, Wikanovic. Well done, lads. The comeback. It's on. It's on, lads. 
Here we go. Here we go. Great ball from Svenningsen. Right into Mikanovic there. It's 3-1. Come on, lads. There's a chance. There's a chance. We only need to win 3 nil away from now. 1-3 is a dangerous scoreline. <laughs> exactly. Oh, no. 4 one is very is not dangerous at all though. Okay, he's put it way wide. Come on, lads. Oh my god. There's a heart chance. 3 2, honestly. Awkward. Oh, on with the big save. Okay, ball in. Cleared. Lockwood. Okay. Highlight over. One minute of our time. <sighs> not the best. We're playing the Convy International Arena. If we ignore the result, there's a lot of positives of that performance. Excuse me? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that's like that's a fucking Southgate thing. We get to the fucking North Macedonia draw. Like, oh, if you ignore the result, I like the mentality. Shut up. Shut up, Southgate. We fu I fucking hate you. <laughs> fucking draw us in North Macedonia. God. God, I hate Southgate so much. Right. Well then, we we got Newtown to play. This is the Newtown technically is the more more important now because we've we're out of the Champions League, but we need to do well in the league, you know, because we need to finish seventh at least for the ma the board to be happy. We got mid table finish again. I I'm aiming this year will probably be a seventh finish. That showed great character, as Rogers would have put it exactly. Oh for God's sake, we let a 36 year old get a golden assist versus us. For God's sake, just break his legs. Um. <laughs> Record attendance, though. And new gate receipt high, 1.4 million. Jesus. Record 38,000. Oh, my God. We filled up the... We filled... Jesus. <clears throat> we smashed it. Oh, my God. 38... Go on the International Arena. We... Oh, my good God. We made a fuck ton of money there. That's like 10% of our revenue... Our, our finances. It really... That, it's more, actually. It's more than 10%. Bloody hell. Okay, Sorensen's on it. Look, Sorensen, I've literally just played you in the past two matches. Anyway, I need to go get some food before I fall asleep. I'll enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you, Viva. I uh, appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your evening, mate. And enjoy your food as well. Hopefully see you later this week somewhere. Right. Um, okay, we've got a training facility nearly finished, though, which is good. New Town. This is, this is going to be the really interesting one. How does this tactic perform against New Town, you know? An away game versus a bottom six opponent that we should be beating... We will see what happens, you know? This is going to be the real test. Because the FC Esch is like the upper echelon, you know? Meanwhile, seven druids were too easy, you know? So it's kind of like, well, this is the tester. A away game versus a bottom six is kind of what we need to be looking forward to. Um, I don't know whether to go with the, uh, the defensive formation because we're away. Or whether we just go for it, you know? We'll go for it. <laughs> You gotta go for it, you know. We'll see. Um, once this save's done, um, we do have Convy up with us this year, and someone else. I don't know who it is. Uh, Tom Pentra, I assume. Yeah, Con Convy, Tom Pentra, come up. Um, so we'll see how they do. All right. That's just so stupid. Barry signing two of the centre backs they sold first season back. Like, why would they do? <laughs> oh, it just makes me laugh. Makes me laugh. They, they, they brought back like three players. I've so, like the, like three players. I think that's been sold already. It's just like, oh wow, I wonder why I've signed them. Well, the cold pickup. I don't know why the hell they resigned him. He's not good enough for them. But that's what the AI does. It doesn't doesn't. No, it plays players that aren't very good. <laughs> okay, here we go. Through there. We also had obviously some Euro qualifying going on um, in the summer. There was some interesting stuff, I think. I don't know. Let's check. Gessens resumes full training, which is good. Um, right. Let's go, though. Newtown away. Let's see. We are getting towards the end of the transfer. I'm not really doing anything at the transfer. I think we've got a big enough squad at the moment. Um, I probably need to do some, some more scouting, though, just to build up stuff. Um, our scouting network's pretty good, though, now. Like, I've got a good, good, few, good amount. Like... Pretty, pretty good of most places. We've got some some different different places now. We've got like Asia, interesting. Europe, yeah, North America. We haven't got any South America though. We need some some Argentinians and Brazilians in our in our um uh what's it called 
staff staff budget. Um, however, it was weird though. They suddenly upped, upped all of our like staff. Like they gave me like eight, six extra scouts and stuff. So now I've got 18 scouts, I think it is, something like that. 15 scouts, no. 19 scouts. Let's go find us another scout. Um, scout. Ah, oh, load. <laughs> Hello, load, and your stream. What a time, Jambo. Hello, <laughs> how are you? Hello, load. How, how, how was your stream, man? Thank you for the for the raid, mate. Appreciate that. I, I'm sorry your raid was it rudely interrupted by Jambo putting Titanic flute on, but <laughs> there we go. Right, I'm trying to. Oh god, there's no actual good scouts, you know. Um, yeah, there, I remember this. Just you. Oh, thank you, Jack. I, I, I thought that might be the, you might come over. Good evening. I'm doing well. I'm doing well, mate. How are you? How was your stream load? Um, Barry win. Have a West win. Okay, interesting. We're just starting our new season here. Um, with Nethi, our third season. Okay, right. Good stuff. Uh, we're playing. Hello, mate. Hello, Southend fan. Tom. I'm doing well. I'm doing well. We, we, we we've, we've started our third season with Nethi now. Um. We got Europe, well, Europa League. After we, we're in the Champions League playoff, we're not going to win it. Uh, we're in 23-15 with Welsh team Thanethi, and we're playing a 3-2-3-2 DM. So, so all the good streamers stream uh, tonight, but not Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Snuck a one 0 and relegation six point at the end. Realistic loot and saves. Oh God, yeah, Jesus, yeah, that must be, that must be something. That must be something. Yeah, fair enough. I'm. Uh, this is this is FM15. No. <laughs> Slight, slightly different. Uh, Luton, did Luton win the Prem in this? They might have. Art's going well. Beat Lazio in the round of 16. Nice. Nice, Jambo. Yeah, we lost 3-1 to FC Ifs at home. Got Porto in the quarters. Oh, good luck. Porto. It's a five-a-side night. Hmm. For Wednesdays. Maybe. Maybe. Right. Um, let's send assistant. Let's go. This is going to be the real just side. A new town away. How good is this new formation with versus them, you know? Um... We will see, because it is something, you know. Oof. Yeah, I remember you saying just all the other good streams, though. <laughs> I think, I think to be fair, though, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday is quite a... Or Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday is quite a um, regular streaming pattern, I think. Because Monday, Wednesday, Friday, you can do, but then you do nothing on the weekend, or you, you'd have to do four, uh, one on the weekend. Also, it takes up people's Fridays. Tuesdays and Thursdays kind of is like that that nice middle zone where you have like two in the week and then you you save it for the weekend or the Friday, you know, which is why I think a lot of people do that. And they don't really do Wednesdays. 4-4 four, four in Lido versus Penny Bond and then Abba and Port Tabot also win. So no upsets so far in the league this this first round. Um, <clears throat> but let's see. Newtown um, away. We got Goitra home. We got Champions League group stage draw, but I don't think we're going to be in that draw. We're we'll probably be in the Europa League draw, I'd assume. Um, but still, Champions Europa League money. Do you think Exodus does Tuesday or, th or Thursday, Saturday, Sunday? Yeah, yeah. It's it it works, you know. Also need to say hi for Nizzy. <laughs> I don't think he's saying hi for Nizzy. I think it's just saying hi in general rather than just coming in, <laughs> chatting away. <laughs> Uh, okay, right. Game day. Let's go. <sighs> Let's see how this for this formation works against Newtown is the question, you know? Um, also, maybe I should put in the tactics about the set piece takers, you know? Make sure we got the correct set piece takers in the right right area, you know? Um, so, like, Asic is on corners. And is on free kicks. And then Ostenek. So one of these guys should be on the pitch at one time, you know? One of these guys should. Lawson. And then we put Anara in. I don't care about Andy Cameron. Anara's my boy. There you go. And then sure, surely one of these guys is, is starting. Hello, Svancy. Hello, how are you? Uh, some people don't even have stream schedule. They just do it. But yeah, that's that's very true. Very, very variable. At least I have a bit of a schedule so you guys know when I'm going to be playing. <laughs> uh, we're going to go for this one, I think. So, oh, it's interesting. They want Inara at the wide midfielder. Perif, Cameron, Mir, Lockwood, Kostinek, Svenningson. I want to play I want to play Inara in the CM. Mm, I'll, I'll drop Inara. Let's put Passage there. 
Fours, Bullock, Halvorsen, Inara. Too many midfielders here. Too many midfielders, not enough strikers. Uh, doing well. Finished fourth versus full season with Chavez. Nice. Very nice, man. We finished fourth as well with, with uh, the Nethi last time. Um, Mikanovic, I want you playing ahead of Pause. Oh, Pause is... That's why Pause is there. Right. Um, right. We need Defender as well. Train. For you. I guess we can get rid of Acuna for uh, Gronsberg. Doyle for... Um, Williams. <laughs> and then we bring in... Where's our 18-year-old? Pause for... Alvorsen. Good God. Maybe we, maybe we take out Train and put in... Where's our Loney? Acuna. So you can play right. You can play left. Dinshich Mikanovic. Okay, this is what we're going to go with. <laughs> Bookmaker set us 13th. Very nice then. Yeah, yours is probably the most consistent screen schedule I know. Well, I try to keep it relatively, relatively uh, consistent, you know. Southampton style 4 2 3 one, doing wonders. Tweaked. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, here we go then. Um, let's go. Let's see how this one performs. we got two new start players starting this time. Farif and uh, Passage's debut. Um, let's see how we go versus Newtown here. They're the favourites for this game. That's very interesting. Oh, Milosevic. I forgot about Milosevic. Oh, and they signed Andrew Curry. He was a player we took on, on trial this year round. So let's see how this goes. Maybe we're going to suffer here. We need to go defensive wingers. But we'll see. We'll see how, what, what, what it looks like early on, whether we need to focus and, and change. But... I feel like this could be against if you put if you're against a team weaker than you. I definitely think you can overpower them with the, the, the like the, the overloads. But against bigger teams, I think we might struggle. But we'll see. Passage with a free kick here plays it in. It's cleared initially by Lloyd Milosevic. Play we sold to them. Hopefully he doesn't come back to bite us too hard. Costanek, Cameron, Costanek again. Cut inside back to Cameron and to Perif and to Lockwood. He's tackled there and Lloyd gets onto it and it's. Lead. Are they going to have a counter attack here? Ferguson. Oh, good, good, good pressure. Morris goes long. Chris and Perif into Klaus. I think I got a bit fortunate with the tackle there. Perif again. Passage Lockwood. And he puts it wide. Oof. You play a mad amount of league when you play in Ireland on FM22 and manage your B team in the second tier in the national. Yeah, I can imagine. You can play a lot, a lot of games there. Uh, Dark God. <laughs> Cameron. Oh, he's hit someone. Um,. I can imagine you hit a lot of games. We, we got a lot of the ball here, but I feel like we are currently watching World Cup 2026. Oh, any, any interesting things going on so far? Like, oh, God, please. <sighs> okay. Um, any interesting, like, uh, what's it called? Um, upsets. Group, groups looking, you know. Lockwood. Go on, Klaus. Lovely. Lovely. Klaus, he's coming home for Christmas. Klaus, what a movie. <laughs> Good stuff. Roots right now. Paraguay beats Spain. Oh, very nice. Lovely little ball from Lockwood there into Klaus. Beats his man. Puts it in the back of the net. 1-0. Played the save for two full in-game years as I started in July partway through first season in Giant. And we played 203. Jesus. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Dark God. Oh, okay. We definitely have such a big overload in that center area. Look at, like, there's so many players in this central area when, when we have the ball. Which I guess helps Lockwood. Ooh, Borges. Mir. Cameron. Lockwood. Malasevich. Oh, he should score. He should score. Ivory Coast beat Saudi Arabia 7 0. Is this the three team World Cup fancy, by the way? I assume. Just beat Livingston 2 0 at home. Time for Porto at home. But what a, what a jump, Livingston to Porto. I get through. I get Stuttgart. Stuttgart. Interesting. They're doing that well. Okay, two to clears. Perif. It's just stat padding at this point. Pa passage. Oh, passage with a good strike. We're very much... Three clear-cut chance. We're very much on top here. A second goal would be necessary. I do feel we're a bit weak defensively. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Porges. Here we go. Lockwood with a good tackle, though. Klaus. Go on. Counter-attack here. Malasevich. Got lots running forwards here. He's going to go himself, though. He's tackled. Cameron. We do have no width, though. Lockwood. I do wonder if we maybe... Like, I... <sighs> Taken off, get narrow off. Maybe I should put get wider on for the wingers, you know? Lloyd. Oh, okay. Chris Ann comes in. Lockwood. How's everyone been then? 
I've been good. Three team groups have been scrapped for 12, 14 groups. Oh, is that a thing in FM24 where they change it? I didn't realize. Perif. Klaus. Go on. Kostanek. Go on. Oh, Kostanek, mate. Come on. You've got to be better finishing, man. You've got to really improve your finishing and soon if, if you're going to be playing there. Cameron, Mir, Perif, Lockwood. Malasevich saved. We've, had, we've been dominating in this. Uzbekistan, Syria, Surin, unnotable teams to qualify. Nice. Perif, great strike. Another save again. Yeah, the format is official IRL. Wait, what? Is it? I thought they were just talking about changing it. They've moved it back to four teams. Oh, you'd love to see it. Maybe I missed that. <laughs> Wait. Oh, why have we got Newtown up here? <laughs> Oh, I didn't know that. Maybe I, maybe I did know that and just forgot. Right. Second, we played incredible, actually, to be honest with you there. Obviously, this, uh, at least I think, uh, this formation works very well against teams weaker than you, I guess. But then probably against the bigger teams, it's going to be, a, we have to go a bit more defensive for it, I think. Um, but we'll see. Oh, I hate this song. Leave it on. There we go. Um, yeah, the four teams was made official a while ago. Go on, Klaus. Oh, come on. Get a second goal. This is going to come back to bite us. Just more uh, groups. Best third place. Go through. Uh, that's so much better. Like, the, the, the I think... I do... I think uh, a big factor was also the fact that the World Cups and the Euros groups were so important towards the last few games that there was so much switching. And they went, oh, yeah, the three team that, that takes away, like, all of the stakes. Um, so I'm glad they did that because three team World Group was, was one of the most stupid decisions they've ever done. Well, apart from expanding it to 48 teams as well. But, you know... <laughs> Pretty much every decision they make. Although you're qualifying with Ireland got off to a bad start. Oh, no. What happened? Match fixing could be a problem in three teams. Oh, yeah, exactly. That's what I mean. Yeah. Two teams could... Like, you can have two teams qualified after the... Like, you can have a team qualified after the first game, depending on how they play against the... Like, they play their game, win. The other two teams play and uh, one of them wins. And that means the other team's automatically through. You know? It's it's just so... It takes a... Oh, Malasevich. Well done. That's needed. 60 second minute. Good stuff. We've been dominant here, which is good. We're with Montenegro first game. Narrowly beat Azerbaijan at home, but lost 2-1 to them away. Ooh. Samir have scored. I saw that. They scored again through a penalty, like the 97th minute. It's incredible scenes. I love love it. Okay. Uh, they've got a kickoff highlight. Into the anyway. danger zone. Um, but we've won the ball back. Cameron, Lockwood, Malasevic. Go on, lad. Benningson. That's offside. Yeah. Sorry. Tamarino FA popping off. <laughs> Hold on. I can actually... Ch Let me just change this now to us. Okay. Lockwood's having an amazing game. Yeah, you're having a stinker, aren't you? Um, let's swap you two. Bring a Nara on. Okay. Tamarino not won a game in my lifetime. <laughs> not mine either. Uh, Cameron. Perif. Only good FA on Twitter. <laughs> Klaus. Kostanek. He's just not been performing today. Nara's going to come on to the left and Passage to the right now. Passage still taking this? Yeah. Even yours. They won in 2004. Did they? Oh, God. You're a lot younger than I thought, Fancy. <laughs> Bloody hell. I, I, I always think you're, you're older, Fancy. Okay. Right. Lockwood. Klaus. Pete Lickson's in 2004. Incredible scenes. Lockwood, Malasevich, penalty? Penalty. Oh, goodness. Lost 3-1. Unlucky. What is this? Hold on. Christ. Malasevich to take the pen. We're going to pause to see what this is first. I work for a global fast news company. I delete the majority of emails they get at work before even reading it. It's important. Someone will follow up. Spend most of my days playing football manager instead. <laughs> I, look, I don't work in a pharmaceutical, okay? I don't. <laughs> yeah, I'm 2005. Damn, Zancy. Youngin. <laughs> Uh, FA Football Association. <laughs> Hibs at home next. Wait, there's a goal, by the way. 3 0. Yes, 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 Didn't know you were that young. Oh, I thought you were saying holy shit to FA Football Association. Being like, is that what the FA means the whole time? <laughs> Malasevich makes it too. Uh, and we're, we're flying in this game, to be honest with you. I'm going to make another sub. I'm going to bring off Cameron for. Oz? He can't play back there. We'll bring on. Um, Ronsberg, Krizan, 
and then um, we'll, maybe we'll do that. Yeah, Lockwood can just play DM. We'll do that. Right, there we go. Um, I would clip that, but no one would make sense of what you're talking about, so there's no point. <laughs> yeah. Well, I said I'm in school, but guess that could be exact. Yeah, no. Yeah. It's, it's, to be honest, it's, well, it's very hard to tell. Like some, like certain times, it's, it's very tough to tell people's ages just from like text when there's such a the different sort of people. You know, there's such a, we have such a variety of ages. It's it's oh Gronsberg. I've just subbed you on, mate. Oh Maras, you're incredible. Oh Maras, you're so good. The open university <laughs> like, it's, uh, <laughs> like it's very it is quite hard to tell sometimes sometimes it's easy sometimes <laughs> but like for the general regular ages it's pretty good of course hard to tell the age of letters wow see that that now that's a very like mature saying so i'd be like how, how, how have you come come from there <laughs> pause oh nearly makes it four but we've been just cruising in this game, which has made me feel a lot better after that uh, FC Ish loss. It might just be that they're very good, you know. They are a French team, you know. So, uh, pause gets to it. Back to Inar. It'll be very interesting to see how we do face it, the, the big clubs, though. That's going to be interesting. I might have to go defensive on those ones. Malasevich, Lockwood. Klaus, again. Lockwood. Beats his man. Oh, terrible shoot. Shot. Shoot. <laughs> terrible shot there. Um... I had a friend uh, tell me I reminded them of their grandpa once. <laughs> I see. So maybe, yeah, maybe you do speak. You speak older than your your age. You know, <laughs> give off the impression of an older soul. Pause. Into passage. Into Klaus. Back to passage. Back to Lockwood. Pause. Into Klaus. Oh, good block. We have created a lot, though, today, which is good. Especially away from home versus Newtown. Look, Lockwood, it's a poor ball. Jesus Christ. I don't know who's supposed to finish top six. I think Lock Newtown are probably predicted set eighth or ninth, maybe. Pause. Malasevich. Sure. One of them that hat trick, but don't think it's happening today. There we go. Full time is upon us. And it's a clear 3 0 win for us, which is a very nice start. I don't know whether it's the formation or maybe it's just the ability of the players at this point. But there we go, 3 0 uh, away from home to start the start the league campaign off. A very nice win. Uh, two assists for Lockwood, two goals from Alasevich. Norway qualifying for the Nog House in 2026. Yo! <laughs> Incredible scenes. Um, let's see. Right, squad, rest of the players up. There we go. Where, where are they predicted this year? Ninth. So they don't know our closest competitors, really, in the league. So it'll be interesting to see the games versus them. But, okay, good. Good stuff. That was a very nice game for us. And a nice little sort of positive boost after that big loss to FCS. We now have played them away, so probably going to go even worse. But, you know, we'll go. To, we'll do the defensive wingers thing. We'll just see what we can do. We, we need to win 3-0 away from home to go through. So I don't think that's going to happen, sadly, today. But still, we get a little bit of money for playing there, and we also get to go to Europa League. So it's a win-win, you know. All previous meetings are losses. So one day we'll be beating this team, you know. One day we'll be facing FCS. Or maybe we might not, because by the time we, we face them, they might have fallen off in France, you know. Could be one of those ones where we never get the chance to sort of rematch them. Third with five points, even with Belgium and Nigeria and... <laughs> with, with Even with Belgium and Nigeria and Suriname bottom with minus 15 goal difference. Jesus. Or Suriname. Okay, I think Isaacson. Oh yeah, gee, oh, bloody Barry in the Welsh Premier League Cup. Like it was like, oh, just giving us a nice, nice person. Obviously, we're gonna be playing the first round next year then as well. It's kind of like the cups. He's like, okay, let's try and avoid big teams for as long as possible. Everyone smacks Suriname and then, <laughs> and then drew against each other. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Shomers takes the Port Talbot hot seat. Interesting. Wasn't he already there? I swear Dominic Shomers has been at Port Talbot before. Final one for the first time with Greenland national team. Nice. Oh, he was a player at Port Talbot. He was a manager at Penny Bond. Oh, yeah, Dominic Shomers. He was fucking... Came second, got sacked, won the Welsh Cup. Like, oh, poor, poor Shomers. Hopefully he does well at Port Talbot. Beat Monaco 1-0. Hey, nice. Right, um, trading facilities upgraded, nice. I don't know what that means we've got now. Um, 
I think we've got pretty basic everything, so it's good to get at least one of them in, you know? Let's have a look. Hold on. It's going to take some time. Uh, facilities? Adequate. Adequate. we got two adequates. Our next stadium sponsors in five years. Right. We continue onwards, though. FC is away. Oof. Result. Smash Lynch in North American Champions League. Three and four seasons they've won it. Okay. Uh, Send assistant. Right. So I think Europa League draws on the Friday. So we'll find out then. Because obviously the, all of the playoff games are probably playing the Thursday here. But we will see. We will see. Um, and there's the end of the transfer window, of course, as well. And then we'll probably be going into a international break where we can check the Euro qualification process to see how the teams are doing, whether Norway are going to miss another major tournament <laughs> as they seem to be in this save. Norway just ain't good in this save. Although we've got two... Uh... Oh, wait, we, we've got one. We've got one good centre-back and Gronsberg's all right. And we've got Al Vorsen. Maybe we can make Norway great again. Although we can only have three Norwegians, so, you know realistic to be fair yeah i saw you're completely out of contention like you can't even get through the playoffs anymore now that's wild that is kind of wild you know you you're both both norway and sweden completely underachieving with with the players they have you know um okay here we go <laughs> right i do not think we're gonna make a comeback here but you know stoke win and a batch win standard win Nine two nine three standardly age one over Real Valladolid. Wow. Right, let's go to this one. Standard, go structured. Um, Acuna, Inara, Kronzberg, Mikanovic, Pasic, Maya. I like Maya. The Pasic actually. We have a whole horse in there. Um. No, we'll keep Kostanek in because it doesn't matter. You know, we go. I guess we we. Technically, should be playing our, our worst players in this game, but we'll put Manolov up top. Put Perif in. Players that aren't happy with the amount of game time they're getting, you know, um, that are still decently good, you know. No, okay, that's good. Um, not quite for anything since 2000, but our best ever squad. So disappointing. Hard group though to be. It, it was a hard group, but it's kind of one of those ones. It's a hard group, but I feel like in the state you're in, you should be winning over scotland you know um you should be at least be putting up a more of a challenge for them but i don't know it's one of those ones it was a tough group um okay what is this jambo as i every time i it's, a, it's annoying that i've got it on full full screen mode um oh wow okay someone just taking man united and losing lots and lots with them <laughs> Okay, um, right. I assume that someone just edited all their players out. Lockwood. How awesome. Would it be a nice start, wouldn't it? Would be a nice start if we could score straight away, but ah, oh, it's blocked there. Uh, right. Cost the neck. Oh, over the bar. Okay, ball in from their corner this time. Okay, missed by everybody. Scotland are doing well to you. Completely bottled our home game again after leaving 1 0 for 80 minutes. Mm, yeah, that was probably a big swing in it. Scotland, oh yeah, to be fair, Steve Clark's done an incredible job with Scotland, you know. Lockwood, oh my god. Go, 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 we 1 0 up. Go, go, Pep just rent his contract for City on that side. Really? Oh wow. Give you next drunk stream, you could do a UK edition. A UK edition? What do you mean by that, Jambo? Of, of drunk stream. Lockwood, amazing. Amazing. Like, have like UK drinks, you mean? Okay, well, immediately they score. They're, these are they're, they're literally set piece FC. He did come um, top half with West Brom. <laughs> okay, well, we we had we had our the lead for a nice little second there, and then they immediately scored from a set piece. Um, it's weird because we have centre backs that start for Brentford, Napoli, Mines, but our start manager starts a guy's thirty five getting relegated with Valerenka. That's kind of like fucking Yane at Sweden. Like you've got you, all these youngsters coming. You got Rooney Bargy coming through. Um, oh, that was a late one, Duckwood. That was very late. Maybe my, I'm, de I'm delayed a lot, you know. Um, and, he, and he's playing like all these, just like, oh my goodness. They're, they're just set piece merchants, man. All they do is score from set pieces. A bit like Steve Clark saying, Jacob Brown on Dykes over Shankland. Mm. Um, it's, it's like, 
fucking like Rooney really Barge not even called up to the team, but then you have players that barely play like 30 minutes for their normal teams, like really old players that just don't play anymore. It's just like, why? Barge shouldn't start for Sweden yet. He, he should at least be in the conversation though with the plays on, you know? He should be called up to the squad to get to get him that experience. But like when you've got that, I, don't, I think you can't go worse than some of the players he's been calling up, you know? I don't know. I feel like it, the, the reason he's like, oh, he doesn't play full 90 minutes and then you like... Robin Olsen is the starting goalkeeper who doesn't play for Aston Villa ever, apart from like maybe Conference League, and then like Augustinson who doesn't play for his national like his club side. It's just uh, not good, not good. The playoffs is very interesting actually. Um, the situation I found a Twitter account that goes through like all the qualifying for like World Cups and Euros and stuff. But uh, and it, like obviously we had we have uh, Africa and Asian uh, World Cup qualifying today as well. So it's like proper like cool seeing it. Like a, there's like spreadsheets of like qualification probabilities. Oh, Klaus. Klaus is in. He's got a lot to do. Oh, sighting. We're playing a lot better in this game, you know. Santiago, Maris with a save. Apparently us getting pot three is better than pot two. Yes. Yes, it is. Because uh, Netherlands are in pot three hilariously. Pot two is a lot nicer. Um, hilariously, pot... Uh, Italy are going to be in pot four as long as Croatia draw or win versus armenia today if they lose then italy will be pot three but if they if croatia get a, at least a draw versus armenia <clears throat> italy gonna be pot four which is kind of wild uh put meyer no mikanovic sorry okay there we go um let's go second half a one one at the half so not the worst although this not good they're going four three three and italy pot three pot italy a pot four now as long as croatia draw i think they have so fallen off. Well, they needed they needed that like remember that I saw the Ukraine penalty that wasn't given apparently. So fucking Seferin saying, "Oh, we need Italy at the Euros," and then they, then Ukraine don't get that penalty in the last minute versus them in the game yesterday. Mm, bit suspect, you know. Italy are just shit, man. Lockwood, Ugh, can't believe we let them win a Euros. Ugh, sucking Southgate, man. <laughs> that was an issues on FM twenty three. Um. Apply for the Man United job after three seasons, gentlemen. They said no because apparently I don't score enough set pieces. That's very weird. Lockwood, Svenningson, go on, lad. Back to Perif. Cross the neck. Lockwood, go on. Play it through. That's offside, isn't it? No, it wasn't. Oh, Mikanovic, you should have done better then. You should have done better. No, oh, that's another free kick, man. They are just set piece FC. FC is. Okay. Um, Freddie Stevens scoring for Juventus then. De Hellas Caballero for CSK. Two former Barry men facing against each other. Mikanovic. Klaus. Oh, Klaus. That was the chance. We've had three clear cut chances. We could be 3 1. Mikanovic. Klaus. It is 3. Well, it's it's 2 1. One more goal and it's level in this game. All right, Jake. All right, mate. Oh, my God. We're level. Um, I, I guess they don't. Euro to miss. I guess they don't. Euro to miss. They don't want to miss the Euros. Not weird, they said, uh, uh, but no reason is weird. It also took one month to answer. Realistic, to be fair. <laughs> Westman. Oh, God, no. Oh, my God. Holder. Yes, they don't want the... Yeah, exactly. They don't want the holders to miss it. Um, oh, God. What have I done? What have I done? Oh, it's a penalty! I clicked off and it's a penalty! Oh, my God. We can make it level. We can level it up here. Holy shit. Holy shit. Mikanovic to take. Come on, Mikanovic. You're the substitute. Come on! Come on, it's level! It's level! Oh my god! Okay. <clears throat> okay, don't panic now. Don't panic now. Mikanovic, lovely stuff. Holy shit. Come on, lads. Oh, it's a danger zone. Into the danger zone. Like. Batista, Jefferson, Jermaine, Westman. Oh my. What is Jake doing? Hold on. <laughs> He's just barking. <laughs> barking at Goodness. He just Jake was just barking at something. I don't know. Hello. What are you doing, mate? I'm a bit excited. better pause, pause in the game for, for jake being a weirdo 
Alright. Okay, hold on. Um, right, I can actually catch up with this stuff now. <laughs> we're, we're still 4-4. Four, four. Um, mech is fuming. Okay. Oh my god, why is the player just there? <laughs> Bloody hell. What, what a... What a... Uh... <laughs> What a way to school grow. Mexico knocked out Germany, Ghana knocked out Colombia. Why does this song sound like a Jet 2 song? I do not know. Also, Austria won Euro 24, beat England the final. Fuck's sake, he got excited as he scored that. Uh, okay. Oh, no. No. <sighs> well, there it goes. 2 3 now. God damn it. Well, we need one. We just need one, and we're throwing away goals. So. It just. <sighs> That's annoying after all, all that comeback. Just just terrible defending again. Come on, lads. Last fifth, last 10 here. Last 10 push. Bottle. What do you mean, bottle? We weren't even in the position to... We were never winning at any point. Okay, the, the, the time's just flown away. They've just decided... The game's just decided that the game's over. You know? Alvorsen, Palmer, Jermaine. We were 3-1 down from the first leg. There's no bottles going on. Like, how can you bottle when you're in the losing position? That's a real shame, though. Four click-up chances, they're zero. That really hurts. Ugh, that hurts. That hurts. They literally scored from a set piece and then scored straight after we scored our third. That's it. My goodness, if we hadn't been so shit at home, we might have actually got through that. But, oh well. Well, Europa League for us this year. Probably better, you know? Probably better. Okay. Um, first leg triumph. Do we we got 1.68 million though for it. Nice, nice. The Europa League. This is, this is, I'm, I'm, this is slander. How many seasons for the record? Hello, Ryan. Um, we got another 228. We're at 300 now. Or are UCL for the <laughs> Thana Midley? Excuse me. No way, Argentina now. Ooh. I hope Argentina lose after all those bottles. Oh, we got 30% of Steve Reese's transfer profit. You love to see it. Um, a lot. Jeez, keep going. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you. Yeah, we're, we're over halfway. The, the record has been broken multiple times since we've since we've started, you know. Like, it was at 4.16, so we were a lot closer, but now we're a lot further away. How many players called up for international? 18. Juliusson, Halverson, Mir, Doyle, Meyer. Tom Sorensen and Gaston Perif, Jones, Klaus, Janovic, Lake Market, Kovacic, Maris, Malaset. Interesting. Nara wants to join Bar here. Interesting. All of 1 0. Mm -hmm. That's a big one. That's a big goal. Right. I think we might see Thursday Europa League games. Oh, Chris Ann. Oh, yeah. We had like bids of like 25 million from Chris Ann. Uh, from Afanolido in the summer, but I returned them down because I'm like, we don't need the money yet, you know? And he's on a longer contract, so we'll just kind of wait until we need to do that. <laughs> okay. We got caught straight away, though, so we can sort of turn turn this loss around. Well, we won that game, technically. So, coefficients-wise, we actually did pretty well there because we won, which is good. Um, okay, let's actually have a look at these champs. Where, where was FC Istra going to be? Barry, I've got Mets, Standard, and Malmo. Interesting. Um, FC, well, that would have been a tough group. Bloody hell. Abois with Fenerbahce, that's actually be an easy group for them. And Pennybont, PSV, Club Bruges, and Barca. Interesting. Okay. Right, well then, we get 1.4 million for playing in the Europa League group stages. Nice. Here we go. Now we got group stages today. So let's see. We're going to be a top pop four side, though. So we're going to probably get a tough, t tough teams here. Um, so let's see what teams we're going to face. Okay, got Sender assistant. Right. Come on. Lottie. Just keep, keep continuing. Oh, excuse me. Bloody hell. Come on. Come on, FM. You could do it. You could do it. Just get me to the day. Good. Four players called up. Cross the neck, Fergus and Chris and Trivial. Okay. So I'm man. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Draw. Where are we? We are. Oh, okay. We're, we, we're not. We're pot four, but we're not the bottom team in pot four. That's Apoel. However, let's have a look at these teams. So, um. Let me take away. I go like. Get up there. 
So probably get rid of it, get a button to get rid of the follower guide as well. Um, so <laughs> we've got uh, Port Talbot leader. We can't face them. Unit sent up Moisey, Kiev, Valadolid, AC Milan, PSG final, Pion, Trabzon Sport, and AZ. So you want AZ, really, don't you? So we'll go through. Okay, there we go. Right, Metalist, Frankfurt, Dnipro, Anderlecht, Osasuna, Barry, Braga, CSK, Twente, Maritimo, Besiktas, and Rubin. Okay. Right, Port Talbot get CSKA. Can't, can't get that team, can't get that group. Rubin, AC Milan. Dnipro Traps on Sport, interesting. AZ get Andalak. That's a nice one, actually. I think I would like to be in Group D currently. Twente, Dino, Moscow. Braga, Dino, Kiev. Frankfurt. I do not want this group. I do not want Group G. Maritima can't be in that group. Osasuna, Feyenoord. Metalist, Valladolid. Barry, Senat, Moisey. And Besiktas, Bayern. Okay. Then we've got Spartak, Sunderland, Delta Porta, Tola. Sparta, Prague, Vittoria, Pleasant, Visse. Vitesse, Tess Estoril, Victoria Guimarães, Alst, Real Madrid. As oh my god, we have nearly the same occasion of Real Madrid and Olympiacos. Okay, Olympiacos, no conference, no conference in FM15. No, it's just the Europa. Uh, Vitesse, Alst, Real Madrid. Okay, in Group D, Victoria Guimarães, Delta Portotola, Spartak, Sunderland. We'll get them. V Vise. Estoril, Sparta Prague, and Victoria Pleasant. Okay, so now this is our... We could, this could be any of us. We're in the same pot as Bournemouth, Paderborn, Copenhagen. And then there's us. We're 18.4 coefficient. Um, well, actually, the Smory bit doesn't join us. <laughs> it stays down there. Um, Bastia, Viroton, Academica, Mines, Haifa, Ludogorets, Zorinsky, and Apo. Okay, so let's see. Are we in Group A? No. Are we in Group B? We are in Group B. Vitesse, Ruben Kazan, and AC Milan. Could be a tough group. Could be a tough group. Okay, Bastia, Academica, Zorinsky, Paderborn, Videoton. As long as, thank God we just weren't in Group G, you know. Haifa, Bournemouth, Mines, Copenhagen. There you go. Right. Um, oh, wait, hold on. Let me do that and then. Right, well, not the worst group, I guess, but some tough ch tough challenges in there, you know? We'll see how we fare in our first time in Europe. Whether we can get some points on the board, help the coefficient out, you know? Campos 1-1, ooh, Lucas a Campos. That's a bit weird. Or is that, must be a future regen, maybe. Um, there we go, I finally, look, lots, of, lots of matches rearranged there. Um, first game is against Vitesse at home. Okay, okay, nice. Oh, that's, oh, Jesus. Jesus. Look at this run, though. Oh, my God. Vitesse, Lido, Barry, Rubin, Abba, Pennybond, Milan, Port Talbot, Have of West Milan. We could honestly get sacked if, if this formation doesn't work well against big teams. Christ alive. Only 22. Lucas at Campos. Yeah, VAR offside, though. Okay, only 12. There could be regens. There's only, that's only three years. There's sometimes some regens come through and are just like, okay, you're just incredible already. Okay, with win. They did no win over Convy, but 4-3. Interesting. Okay, got Goitra though now in the league. Every league point is is uh, big, so we need to, to do, do well here. It's a home game, so we should win. You hope we'd win. Um, but we'll see. Belgium are starting some 19, 17-year-old right wing back. Regen, Jesus. There you go, exactly. Ben Brazil. Oh, my boy, Ben Brazil. What a name. What an absolute god-tier name, Ben Brazil. Just some players you got to sign because they're names, you know. <laughs> okay, let us go. Ready for this game. Um, thing. Dunchic is not happy about first team football. I'm sorry, mate. I'm sorry. Look, it's just going to be tough at the moment. All right, switch back to this one. You're a bit more attacking. No, they're not. They're not guessing playing there. Okay, Costa next, Henningsen, Malasevich. Uh, Maya, Bors, Acuna. Let me just bring in a youngster down here. Robert Roberts. Put Bors in for Perif. Um, Ferguson's nearly fit and booze there. Manilov, put Manilov on the bench. 
for Maya. Um, I'm guessing starting is big. Oh, yeah, let's give it to him. Um, right. I think, well, maybe we want passage on the bench. Though. Yeah, we don't have any mid wingers on the bench, actually. I need to for not forget about that. Um, where's passage? Passage. Point on the bench for... Manilov instead. He can play both sides, you know. Right, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Squad number's going to give it to two players and guess and get to number 21. Um, 21? <laughs> um, they go with a 4 5 1. Let's see how this plays versus Glitcher at home. Um, one of attacking very fluid. Maybe we should say structured. I don't know. We'll see how things go in this game here. Um, but we will see. Chirilla with an early foul there. Hopefully with a similar level of domination we did versus Newtown. Don't, oh, yellow card already is not what you want to see early on in this sort of game. Um, but here we go. Inara. Mir. Penalty. Well, that's a good start. Malasevich should take. Okay, you got to put us 1-0 off early. He can. Lovely stuff for Malasevich. Is that his sixth of the season already? He's flying. Oh, we're in the round of 16 again. Nice. Big win there. Big win for them. Malasevich, boom. Right away. Lovely stuff. Okay, let's actually see some actual play from the team, you know? Not, not, we want, we want open play goals, not, oh, goodness. Ooh, that's a bit weird. What the shit, Qatar almost got to the semis of the World Cup. Wow, that's pretty big. Well, Qatar got to the semis of the World Cup in, in this save as well. Um, but it was a long way in. And Gessen, oh, it's cleared off the line. Carilla does get there, though, thankfully. We haven't had as many chances in this game, for sure. Um, Cameron, go on. Maybe, I, maybe I'll go structured here. But lost the eventual winners, Germany. Hmm, I think uh, Qatar would, got to the semis when they hosted. And then they lost 5-0 to England in the semi-final or something like that. <laughs> I'm going to say I'm not, um, I'm, I was about to say I'm not happy, but I accidentally said I am happy. But only 1-0 at half time and basically like no chances is not what you want to see. Um, so we'll see how things go in the second half here. Did you see Austria won Euro 24? I did. That's pretty, that's pretty huge. That's pretty huge. Uh, but especially for 2024, you know. Ragnik is cooking. <laughs> oh, yeah, Ralph. Oh, I forgot Ralph Ragnik's Austria manager now. It's such a weird one. It's like that and Bielsa at Uruguay beating both Argentina and Brazil for the first time since like, they won the World Cup, you know. It's kind of wild. Okay, Kostanek plays in Gessen on the edge. Cameron, Lockwood. Can he put it across? Kostanek's there again. Lockwood, you got to finish that, mate. Oh, come on. It's a good block. But that really should have resulted in a goal. Okay, Newtown just might be terrible this year. They're losing 6-0 uh, to Port Talbot. Maybe they're just having a bad year. Um, right, I'm going to bring on Mikanovic for you and swap you two over. Because Austria beat Germany 2-0 today. Wait. In, in real football? Sorry, in real life? I didn't even know that. I wasn't following. They're friendly. Um, oh yeah, there's lots of Africa qualifying here what's going on in the europe netherlands won six nil over Gil gibraltar france drew two two with 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 greece that's pretty is that big is that a big thing did that did that affect where they come in their group um no it didn't might have helped greece okay israel won against andorra belarus won romania beat switzerland oh that's interesting wales drew with turkey one one Croatia won. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. I'm going to have to look at all these groups, you know. What the hell's going on? I think Croatia now have confirmed Italy a pot four with that win against Armenia. What? what if Switzerland lost. What is the groups going on? Okay. Romania and Switzerland go through top. Israel, 15 points. Okay. Um... IRL friendly. Hope uh, to get. Ah, oh, I, I, I did, did. There was a big thing about the the tickets, wasn't there? Where loads of people got rejected for them already. Like the the, like and there were then apparently I think a bot had just infiltrated and bought them all up or something. There was some because my mates applied for tickets and none of them were successful, and they had like a hundred of tickets applied for, um, between all of them. I think maybe someone got four and that was it. By the way, we're going about to concede here and I'm not going to be happy. Okay, Maris with a big save. I'm not playing. We're not playing well in this game. Um, first round of tickets got rejected. I, I heard there was a big, big thing with, um, boys. Come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, what a save, Maris. 
Oh, you fucking idiot, me! You idiot! Fuck! Oh, we're gonna draw against Goitra at home because of me being an idiot. Oh, God damn it! God fucking damn it! Schneider, God fucking damn it, dude. We still do more rounds of fans of qualified teams. Oh, okay, I see. They've actually been... The have been the better team than us here. I don't know what's happened in this game, but we've just not been good. What happened against Newtown is a, it was a fluke. Thank you, Duck God. I appreciate it. Uh, oh. They nearly scored again because for some reason... Our defenders have just turned off for some reason. I don't know why, but they've just forgotten how to play fucking football, it seems. I don't know what's happened to... Like... They're going to they're gonna win this game at this rate. Malasevic, go on. Mikanovic. There's a good counter here. Go on, Lockwood. Keep us out. Pull it. <sighs> Jesus, man. Jesus. You're going to drop some fucking hell and guessing. We're dropping points here then today. What a fucking terrible game this was. Shocking result for us. That's really poor. Really, really poor. Fuck's sake, man. I gotta play Barry at home. Ah, oh, so annoying. So annoying we conceded like that. We didn't play well, though, which is the worry, you know? Um, hmm. Started so well as well, and we just didn't do anything with it. Okay. Gesson makes his debut or his return. Right, Barry now at home. This is going to go well. Change my favorite team on the app to Denmark. <laughs> The way Croatia next. Oh, that's an interesting round of 16 round tie. Okay. Right. Let's see then. Uh, anything going on here? No. Okay. Barry at home. It's not going to go well. But. We'll play the defensive one again. Brazil, Belgium, and Spain, France on the same day. What a round of 16. <laughs> we, the, if that was like the one we were watching in, in, in our save, we'd be like, okay, Norway, Croatia all day. Like, we wouldn't be watching the big boys. <laughs> right. Um, still going to Ransky. Like that of Argentina plans. Okay. Anything going on? Nope. Okay, we've got to register our team for the Europa League, though. Norway Croatia is the day after. Ah, I see. I see. Okay. Right. Anything here? Seema wants. To f look, Seema, mate. I want. Look, I want. I would love for you to get some first team football, but you're not. You're not. A, you're not. You don't play any formation players positions we play. You know. I've tried to loan you out, but no one's interested. I need to get like a lower league team as an affiliate, like a, a Welsh team. Um, to send my players to. Maybe maybe we can try that, you know. If I can, if I do the send alone players to, may, they should give me non-league Welsh players, and I can see if I can send players to that. They'll probably reject it, but it could be something, you know. Um, let's have a look if this works, you know. Because I know Afon Lido have, like, players like that, but I don't think they would accept it is the problem. I think they'd be like, we're too good for that. So we'll see. If a, a Welsh affiliate's fine because you're going to get more Welsh players, you know. Um, like, let's get send players out on loan. So we'll see if that works. Um, anything here? If we if we had if there was more than one league, it would work better. But you know, Malasevic. Oh, okay. Two bids. Not very good bids though. So I'll say no to those. One point three k. One. Congrats. Oh, thank you. Hilariously, I think we've gone down in followers. We were at like 1.3k and like 3 or 4 at one point. Three of the top of, of the top five signings of the season were my signings combined fee of 950k. Nice. Oh, we should check that. We should check our season summary from the previous year to see uh, if we got anything, you know? Most improved or something like that. I think there is, they do that for Wales. They just don't announce it. Oh, apologies. Yawn today. Um, let's see. First here. Oh yeah, this is this is deadline day for everybody else, which is why all this stuff's going on here. I've got lots of people on my shortlist that are probably moving around. Press the live. Oh my days. How many fucking Oh my god, this is the problem having so many people on your shortlist. Just gives you so much information you do not need. 
Um, good God, was, was there? Any, no, nothing was interesting there for us. Um, Wales. Right. On, I think it's like season summary or something. History. Overview? No. Season summary. There we go. Um, okay. Boselli. Inara with the most assists. Lovely. Overachievers of Thanethi. You love to see it. Underachievers Lido. Sign of the season. Craig Lester for 200k. Runner up. Frank Ferguson for zero. Craig Lester for 200k. Brother. Brother. Oh, I don't think that's. I think I think Frank Ferguson did him there. You know, worst signing this season. I think it's Philip Corny. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very annoying. Okay, limited from the Euro Cup playoff final. Won the Champions League. You love to see it. Okay. European. Yeah, there there we are. Okay, right. Let's go then. Team today. <laughs> We're going to just hope for the best. Team selection. Oh, someone's already... Up. Oh, Christ. Two of them. They've, all, they've fucked off already. God's sake. Okay. Carilla, Krizen, Kronzberg, and Boo going to get his debut. Kovacic also going to get his debut. Sorensen, Cameron, Lockwood, Svenningson, Malasevich. Maya, Passic, Julius, and Frank. You can come on the bench, mate. Then we've got a midfield. Yeah, we got everything now. Right. Two more debuts. Let's go. Mbu and Kovacic. Let's go. Let's see how we fare here. Probably not well. But, you know, one of those. Uh, we're underdogs here. We did beat them last time we played them hilariously. So, you never know. You never know. Okay, we'll see how this, this, this formation works versus Big Barry. Although, are they playing their starters? They are playing their starters, actually. So, we'll see. Chirilla, why are you taking... Oh, it's because no one's there. Sorensen. Oh, Ronsberg. Oh, God. Reese is running. Kovacic, well done. Uruguay gone in the round of 16 as well. Top five random rivalries, literally. All due to Suarez. <laughs> okay, set piece over the bar. Another set piece over the bar. Lovely, lovely. Although they're starting to grow into the game a bit here. Bilic, Catanillo, Borselli. Cameron with a good tackle, but Sabuga's there. Oh, well done, Mbu. Come on. Counter-attack here, but Mbu's going. Plays it back to Carilla. Chrisan, Cameron, Lockwood. Go on. Oh, he's tackled there. It's a really bad position to get tackled as well. Reese on the counter attack now. Schmidt, Catanillo, Sapuga, Maras with a big save. Favorite round of was one when Bodo played Roma like four times. And yeah, that was that was really odd. It was I guess it was at group stages and then the knockouts. You played each other or something. Uh, Lockwood, go on. Boo, go on, lad. Great cross. Oh, it's not a good cross. Never mind. Carrieri saves with these. But the, 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 the meaning is there, you know? The meaning is there. Okay, Gronsberg. Kovacic. Oh, doesn't get past Carlos there. Tried to beat him, but it didn't. And Reese is now on it. Carlos. Borselli, Sapuga, Maris with another big save. Okay. All right, come on, lads. Get a shot on target today. Okay, Carlos again. Derek Dal. Their new signing. New old signing, you know. Billet, Schmidt, Catanillo into Reese. Good save again, Maris. He's saving us a lot at the moment. Carlos, Catanillo. Highlight still continues, though. And Boo with a good tackle, though. Okay. Free kick us. Cameron plays it in. Sorensen. Gorilla. Back to Mbu. I'm going to quickly go to set pieces and put um, Andy Cameron on these as well. Because obviously, we don't want our centre back taking corners, you know. Okay, Mbu. Gorilla. Lockwood. Go and play it in. Klaus, turn and shoot. Oh, over the bar. Close. Okay, and here's Barry again with another chance. Gets to Carlos to Reese. Good block, though, for the corner. At least we've had a shot on target some, from somewhere. Ball in again. Cleared again. Bilic. Derek Dow. Okay, Cameron with the foul. Borselli. Ooh, Maris forced into making a save there, actually. I thought it was going over, but it saved it. 
Um, ball in, cleared at the front post. Harrison just attended a job interview for the Burnley job. Oh, good luck. Maris. Come on, lad. I thought that was a penalty, by the way. But thankfully, it was... Oh, come on. Barry, come forward again. Reese again. I think... Okay, well done. Reese. if you take shots like that every time, I'll, I'll be happy, mate. Cameron, free kick. Oh, into the wall. Pulls back out to him. Try and get us. Nope, never mind. Second phase. Nope. No, not what you're talking about. Okay, Lockwood. Why didn't. Just take it down, lad. Lockwood, mate, you're having a shocker today. You are having a shocker. That... He's just passing the ball to them every time he gets it. I don't know what's wrong with him at the moment. Normally, he's a lot better. Borselli. Over the bar, though. Meteoric rise after threes of a Germany with zero badge and reputation, to be fair. Also, ads, what the fuck? Yeah, no, ads come in sometimes now because of Twitch, you know? Oh, my hat went. Um, they, um, pleased with how things are going. Keep it up, lads. They've switched to a more attacking formation, so we'll see how things go. Um, right. Have, have you finished with the ads yet, Fancy? So I can, I can, you can hear me. <laughs> yeah, this is not looking a good start, though. Borselli. Schmidt, good save. Really save, yeah. Okay. Um, what, what do you mean meteoric, meteoric rise, though? Um, are you saying well, where did you go from? Like, what's what's the journey so far? But yeah, ads are just Twitch now. They force you to have them, so it's like, oof. Just put them in and put minimum, you know. <laughs> Miller Savic scored for Newtown versus Petty Bot. He just he's amazing. He never he didn't work for us in that second season because we had better strikers, but. Okay, go on. Win that. Oh, my God. Okay. Hornet on for Cataneo. Cameron, free kick. Into the wall again. Cameron, please. Put it over the wall. Started in 30 of Portugal. Only three years. And I'm in the brand new pre job. Oh, wow. Okay, fair enough. I thought you'd moved around more than that. But, yeah, Jesus. Not bad at all. Kovacic. Oof. Carlos. Reese. The longer we hold out, the better it is. We've got 20 minutes to go here till extra time. Bruno Martin's on for them. But we're still just holding on, you know? Maris is doing very well for us, but still, okay. Cameron's on a 6.8 and a yellow card and 64%. But full time is approaching here quickly. And unless they score now, which they might might as well, might well do as, yep, yep, yep. Oh, what a tackle, Cameron. What a tackle. Just preventing a sure fire goal there in the last minute or two. Oh my God, Maris. Oh my God, Gros Grosberg off the line. Holy fucking shit, lads. Jesus, what is some last-ditch defending? He's offside. Oh, my good God. There's still a minute to go here, but my good God, what a tackle by Cameron. That is insane. Okay, just give it... Okay, Torrenson, Lockwood. Go on. Malasevich. Oh, Malasevich, such a, touch, such a poor touch. And to touch a poor ball, Gronsberg. Like, it just feels like we're not playing today, you know? Well, we're, like, we're defending well. We're just not attacking well. Carrieri goes long. Out for a throw. It's going to be full to extra time here, I think. Yeah, there we go. Extra time. Um, please, the full answer. Okay, Cameron, you need to come off, fella. You're too tired. Ferguson. We don't have DMs, do we? No. Ferguson's going to come in for you there. Kovacic for you. Lockwood, also you're playing like shit, but we can't replace you at the moment. Chrisan's a bit tired. We're going to leave it for now, just so we don't have to go down to 10. Who's dead? No! <laughs> They've injured Maris! No! Those bastards! The one time I actually did put a goalkeeper on the bench hilariously, and we, we've somehow got away with it. But they've injured Maris, those bastards. Why would you do that to him? He's 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 innocent. He's innocent. Bystander. Lockwood. Go on. Klaus. Malasevic. How's Curry? Yeah, he saved that. I've lost my hat. Lost my hat. How has he saved that? It was a literal sweaty goal and he saved it. I cannot believe it. Oh, that was the chance, man. That was the chance. First season half was in the 30. Then got a job in the top division. Barely avoided relegation after joining March and finished fourth. Oh, oh okay. You did move. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Doyle. Okay, Doyle come in to make the... the, the Goggy performance of his life. This is when legends are made. Thank God I saved that sub, by the way. Like, thank God. Um, but nice. That's awesome. House gone. Oh, okay. <gasps> that, oh, they have. They had an injury. 
Well, Selly's injured, though, which is interesting. Um, God, Klaus is dying out there. Come on, lads. Just 15 more minutes to hold out. And maybe we can get to Penn. Still only got a Continental Sea license. <laughs> Are you even allowed to manage in the Prem, you know? <laughs> Doyle goes long. Up to Klaus. Takes it down well. Lockwood. There's a lot more space over available. And Boo on the ball. Go on. Get around the corner. Get around him. You've got two of them. Lockwood. Pull it across. Oh, why is he shot? Will still intensifies. Oh, no. Not Will still. Bassett holding up there. It plays it in. Lockwood. Ferguson. Fucking hell, man. I know they want to end the highlight, but let's just... Come on. Okay, five minutes to go here. Boo's dying out there. My man is dying. Trilla's dying. There's a highlight, though. Sorensen. Lockwood. Loses out, but Sorensen gets it back. Lockwood again. Oh, Lockwood, man. He's Lockwood's had a real shit game, honestly. Schmidt. Is he playing striker? I think he, he might be, you know. Um, yeah, Lockwood's had a poor game for his standards, man. I would have had a Nara there. Oh, good stuff, Gronsberg. Cole pick up. Reese. Oh, he's offside. Get in. My CDM one goal of the seed. Is nice. Oh, no. Oh, what a tackle, Gronsberg. Oh, my days. <sighs> Hold on for pens now, boys. Schmidt. Sabuga. No. Oh, well, good tackle. Go on. Oh, Malasevich has had a shocker again. Sabuga. Oh, well done. So sorry, sorry. Take that one. I've been robbed for manager of the year. <laughs> one minute of added time. Oh, my God. There's a highlight in that. And the added minute. Oh, well done, Chris Ann. Malasevich, get there. Go on. Counter, mate. Counter. Oh. Alasevich, just, yep, throw it to him. Bring it back and boo. Go on. One more. Oh, no. Gorilla, well done, Ferguson. Ten seconds to go, Lockwood. Get a shot off, Malasevich. Get a shot off. Get a shot off. Oh, for God's sake. Right, penalties here. Sure. Um, behind goal. Um, let me drop it down a bit. Right. Malasevich. Lockwood. Gorilla. Prison. And hilariously, our defenders are the best penalty takers of the ball for some reason. So, sure. Which one are we at? We're up this way. Okay. They go first, annoyingly. Um, one of three nominees as well. 13th expectation, finish fourth, but the sporting manager gets it. It's a disgrace. It's a disgrace. <laughs> Right, Thomas Schmidt up first. Obviously, every Barry player is a former player I've managed. Uh, well, not every Barry player, actually. Never mind. Borsch, uh, Reese, one of them. But Thomas Schmidt, step up first. Doyle, the substitute keeper. Can he make an incredible penalty save performance? Oh, he got close. He got close in the first one. Got close in the first one. Malasevich, he scores a lot normally. Oh, he scores that time. Just about, though. Just about. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have, we have the perfect... I forgot we, we found the new one, didn't we? Um, close? Yeah, this is it. This is it. I mean, to be fair, they, um, they won the league only losing once. Bottled Invincibles in the second last. Ooh, okay. Yusuf Samir, the centre-back. Taking. Ah, he scores. He scores. Okay. Doyle's pink boots trying to put them off. Next up, Lockwood has a, had a shocking game today. Ah, oh, and the shocking day continues. Lockwood single-handedly costing us this game so far, it seems. Harrison to put them 3-1 up. Scores. Oh, we're in a bit of a shit now, don't we? Aren't we? Chirilla steps up for us. Scores. Okay, okay. Needed, needed. Come on, Doyle. We need a, need a, need a penalty save. Sapuga. Oh, so close. Okay, we need to score to stay in it. Need to score to stay in it. Chris Sand steps up. Scores. We need we need them to miss. We need him to miss or a save in the last one. Derek Dow, the centre back. Scores. Lockwood. Lockwood cost us the game, sadly. He's had a shocker. Apparently he was on a 7.3, but. Unlucky, lads. Unlucky. A penalty shoot loss again. Friendly game, but I've got a World Cup match to watch. Sorry, lads. <laughs> that's, that's me. Just cancel the friendly. Cancel the friendly. Got better places to be, lads. But we did well, honestly. Like, we got away with a bit there, but oh, it's a shame. It's a real shame. Bruh. Look at this dude. Who are we checking? Who are we checking? 
Um, shame we went out on pens there. All right, rest everybody up. We got international break anyway, though. So, um, oh wait, how bad was the injury? Maras, he's fine. Wow, that's weird. Not cancelling the friendly. Assman deals with it. Oh, for my one, I have to cancel it because it's even though my assistant manager controls it, they want like uh, the Welsh league record for most man of the matches per season. <laughs> sure. Um, records. Um, most. Oh goodness. Most player of the match. Sixteen for Vela, our boy, uh, in 22-83-84. So half half of the games where he, he was man of the match for. Also had high average rating of an 8.83. Uh, not bad. Not bad. Hilariously, the most goals in the match from a Port Talbot player with seven. Sadie, one of our players from the Port Talbot era to, to our second season there. Interesting. Definitely leader very early on. Most team points, Barry. The old Barry. Did know most games that score. Most games that seeding leader with 19. Petentra most games without winning. Most games without losing. Affidated 964. <laughs> uh, good stuff. All right. Yeah, those barriers 77 times winners now. Taking over the record for most league wins. All right. Okay, we've got, we got 12 days till Tom Pentra. We've also got to do our Euro Cup registration, which is probably similar to our Champions League registration, but it probably means I have to do it all over again, annoyingly. Um, so we'll see. Um... Highest average of attendance still have the West, interesting. Um, I guess they have the biggest stadium, don't they? Okay, those transfer windows done. For us, no. Right. England win on pens versus Mexico. Ooh, okay. England World Cup winners. Okay, Convy loan for late Marquee. Sure, why not? Take part in this as well. Alan Murphy. Barry. There's good potential there, you know. That, the natural good Irish striker. Wow. Attack mid slash striker. I say good. He's okay. But we'll see. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Going to Parker on loan. Sounds a do offer. Alois is Christian Tronsky. Maybe we should just check the loan market real quick. Um, let's see what is available for us. Louis Rivera, Vidal as a striker. Apparently, he wouldn't even be that good, but maybe you maybe you loan him because he's apparently like very good. <laughs> um, who else do we look at loaning? Be just him at this point. Oh, I should probably check the values, you know. He's worth 14 mil, you know. Let's have a look. Um, he's the most highest value. Then you've got Palaiso. Uh, you've got a bunch of more Barry players listed for loan here as well. Um, also, what was that? Need on Monmouth. Okay, Bal Balor or TNS. That would have been such a nice draw for us. We just got Barry early. Just fucked us. Garner have beaten Uruguay. Vengeance, finally. Goitra, <laughs> uh, Palaiso, Vidal, Tomish, Sergio Gomez. Transfer listed and listed for loan. You know what? How much do you want? <laughs> How much do they want for transfer? Two million. I'll, I'll take you for loan, mate. Sure. Take him on loan for the year. Um, right. Send you out on loan. Troyansky off to Aberystwyth. I don't know how is that you spell it. Vengeance. Vengeance. It, feels, it all feels wrong. Uh, ven, ven, vengeance. Just the A, I think. Potentially. I don't know. Vengeance. What did I spell? Vengeance. Vengeance. Oh no, I, I put it with the E A actually. And I spell it myself. Let's go check. Ven Ven it's E A. It is EA Sports. Um <laughs> Let me go look at those friendly things. Friendlies. 
fucking hell. Germany are fucking shit, man. Havertz playing left back again. You love to see it being terrible. Sarno with a red card. Oh, that probably helped things. I need to get that red. What oh, got worse? It doesn't tell you when the big events were anymore, Bill. At least on desktop. EA. Yeah, he's supposed to say, hey, we both made the same joke. <laughs> Right. Okay. Let's get, let's bring in Vidal. See if, see how he does this year. Like we're just just having him as an option, you know. Um, may, may take some game time away from other people, but you know, always good to have options. All right. Have him as a complete forward. How does how does he stack up? Hilariously, he's our, our fourth best, you know. Um, and Gomez also as a centre back. To be honest, he's probably better than Gronsberg, Gons Gomez, and he's very cheap on the wages, so. Colombian centre back coming in for £975 a month. Very nice. Yeah, well, okay, yeah. He's saying they're saying he's better than Gronsberg, so not bad. Okay. Um and ooh, Barry signed Peter Strandl. Strandl? A right back. Interesting. Alright. Oh, there we go. You Europe qualification going on there as well. Let's see. Oh, excuse me. Right. Um, let's have, see have a look what's going on here. The 14th, okay, 14th of June, 1st of September. Norway beat Azerbaijan 3 2. There you go. Um, did we have our boys playing? No, neither of them did play. Oh, Hal Vorsen came on, and Mir was an unused sub. Okay. Uh, Iceland win, Holland win, France beat Denmark, Hungary win. Belgium win, Ireland, Bulgaria is 2 2. Um, you've done well actually so far, Norway. Four wins, only the one lost in Netherlands, which is expected, but very good on 12 points so far. Maybe you will be making the Euros for the first time in a while. When was the last time Norway made a, 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 a tournament in this save? <laughs> let's, let's check. Um, let's do competitions, I think. Let's see. Um, World Cup 2274. 2312. Okay, well, they, they made the Euros in 2312, actually. That was the one we didn't watch. Yeah, we didn't watch this one. Um, but before that was 96. I remember we got to the quarters one watch along. Um, second round, there's a quarter... That's two, 2260. Yeah, 2260. That was a quarter finals. That was very early on. World Cup. Yeah, that, it must have been this one here, the quarterfinals in 2260. We started the, the watch longs in like 42, 44. So it was a very early on. And since then, have not, you've not been very good. <laughs> but maybe qualifying for Euros at this point. My first watch long, I think. Damn, but wow. <laughs> that's, oh, that's terrible, that is. Getting the high of getting to the, to the quarters and the first watch along. Giving you like the taste for more, and then never, they're, Norway never doing anything since then. <laughs> it's like you can never get catch the first high again, you know. Oh, that's good, <laughs> mate. Who knows? Maybe this time, this time it's gonna happen. I swear. <laughs> right. Um. Go. Anything going on? No. <laughs> it's me. Okay. Under 21, that's interesting. Um, that's a deadline done. Okay, register players for the next phase. Um, do we have more spaces this time? No. No, we can't register more players. We're just going to have to say no again to everybody. Sorry. Um, all right, we go again. 10 days till the next. We go, what, go through all these Euro qualification games, though. And a save. Um... But be very interested to see who's qualifying for what with the Euros, you know. Um, it's a double header of Russia Euros, Russia World Cup, which is interesting. Um, <laughs> I don't think it's as bad as it was, just due to the fucking new conflicts that are appearing. But it's still, one of those ones, you know. What? How do you make a logo? You know. <laughs> we will see. We've got to try and remember it's an alternative universe where stuff like that does not happen. Um, but we're gonna we'll keep some level of subtlety. I hope I've still got to design, I've got to design the logos this week. I don't think we'll. I think at this rate, I don't know how how much time I'll have depending 
between now and at the moment we're finishing the seasons pretty quickly because i don't have europe but now i've got europe it's sort of like oh okay um but maybe we aim for ending the season saturday and then we do like group stage knockouts next week next tuesday um next tuesday thursday maybe or then it is either that oh you listening it's his first iceland goal or then it'd be like thursday saturday you know so something probably ne next thursday at least will be euros tuesday uh after my i mean my left back is worth one point one to three million he got mad i rejected offer i said if someone offers 10 mil i was said he was like cheers boss <laughs> that's pretty decent get some good money there so he's staying <laughs> oh finland drew with portugal nil nil there ukraine win also world cup qualifiers going on in asia currently african champions league into the semi-finals interesting okay um Stanyak. um welcome to the qualifiers the second austria beat sweden oh no uh estonia drew with san marino san marino getting a draw there spain beating montenegro draw there england beat slovenia italy win uh, yeah i mean a draw Czech Republic win, Georgia win, Ukraine win. Okay, uh, Albania beat Croatia and Slovakia beat Scotland. Belarus drew with Germany and Turkey beat Serbia. Bloody hell. Finland draw with Portugal and Wales beat Liechtenstein 3 1. Some very interesting results there. Okay, keep continuing. And then, oh, why Warren Point Town were relegated from tier two of Northern Ireland after coming second last year. Um, hilariously, that's Chloe's uh, home team. Um, I think. I think remember she said something about it was like financials or like pitch or something like that. There was some issue which basically got relegated um, for it. Norway Croatia is nil nil after 30 minutes. Oh, okay. Bit a bit cagey, bit cagey. Right. Um Vorsum injured. Ugh, not what we want to see. But you know. Um Croatia dominating. Okay. Oh, Holland beat Luxembourg 8 0. Oh, a draw with Iceland. You did get a. Oh, wow. You got a, what you thought was a late winner, but then Hawkerson, Iceland leveled it. Uh, Switzerland 4 0. Hungary win. France win. Bulgaria beat Belgium. And Ireland and Bosnia and Herzegovina draw. Where is the Belgium result then? Interesting. Where are Belgium? They are top of their group still due to everyone sort of taking points off of each other, but it could get interesting. In there, Germany have drawn two games and one only one, so they're on five points currently. Interesting. Right. John Penter in seven days, but we got lots more Euro qualifying to get through. I think. <laughs> um, I want to play Tom Penter. I want to play Europe as well. We want to do Europa League, don't we? Um, at least the uh, first group game, you know. Lloyd West announced his intention to leave. I think. Thoughts on Cole Palmer. What a boy. What a boy. Ugh. He's incredible. What a boy. You know, the balls. The balls on, on, on him as well for that Man City penalty. Like, Jesus Christ. He is... Oh, he's, he's, he's great. He's great. <laughs> I love him. Um, right. What else is going on there? Uh, Sweden win, Austria win, Spain win, England win, Slovenia win, Poland, Greece draw, Italy win. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Days to go. Besseling. Okay, Dunda. Saulo. Oh, look, go on, Saulo. Former Brazilian turned to Austrian. Palmer makes me miss uh, Fernandez, to be honest. <laughs> to be fair, yeah, Palmer's got, Palmer's, Palmer's got quite a few, good few uh, goals from penalties. However, he has got a lot of assists as well, which is also good. Oh, Wales got a good draw there. Um, like, he he isn't just penalties. He he makes our offense tick so much more. Like, oh, he's so, he's so good, man. So good. He's the player we thought we were getting in habits, really. Never gets pens nowadays. No, he doesn't. It doesn't seem like it. Okay, Gibraltar lose to Czech Republic. Northern Ireland win 5-1. Big win for Ukraine as well. Slovakia beat Croatia. Scotland win again. Germany draw again with Serbia. Turkey beat Andorra. Finland win. And what's going on with these? What, how many games we got? Okay, that was the final group day, stage game. So Spain absolutely dominating at the top. It's a race for second between Austria and Sweden. Northern Ireland are still top. 
Oh, my days. They drew with Georgia and lost to Czech Republic, but they're still top. Georgia also second. Look at this. A, a four-way fight for the lead, just like Fernandez wasn't just pens, but it's very nice to have. True, true. Um, Netherlands top with theirs. Norway in second, although the draw with Iceland has sort of brought them into the clutches of Switzerland a little bit. Uh, Slovenia top uh, after beat after England lost to Israel, but England do have a game in hand. Slovakia top five wins from five. Scotland in second. Albania, Croatia nowhere near this year. France top four from four. Denmark, Hungary there. Italy two draws already. Poland and Greece waiting in the wings. Belgium lost to Bulgaria, but everyone's are still fighting each other a bit. Turkey top. Serbia level, Belarus third, and Germany with six points. Andorra have a minus 28 goal difference. <laughs> oh, God, a poor Andorra. And Wales top of group uh, J, by the way, with the draw versus Portugal. My goodness me. Odegaard, why would you shoot from there? <laughs> okay, well, then, it's interesting. So, I think six games in. How many more games is there? Um, well, some teams only have two more. September, October, November, I guess, yeah. Only two more games in some of these groups, so it'll be very interesting to see. Hello, Jabo. Hello again. How are you? Oh, apologies. Put you on in. I do want to check. Um, is anyone qualified yet? No, I need to go to this. Is anyone qualified yet? No one's qualified yet for the Euros. Yeah, okay. England are holders. Uh, Sawloth on the pitch is a wide target, man. Oh, God. Going back to Chester doing two saves is tough. I can imagine. I can imagine, mate. Okay. There's some Asia World Cup qualifying going on as well. Let's see. I'm just glad International's break is now over until March. Like, oh, thank God. Right. Anyone who use Wide Target Man effectively? Um, no, because Wide Target Man isn't a thing in FM15. <laughs> and I do not play enough 24. Oh, Klaus starting for Denmark. How did he do? 17 minutes. Only got the, the, the one sub appearance, sadly. Off the chest, I'll do a Gibraltar Builder Nation. I'm like, oh, okay. That's a good idea. Nice, man. Okay. Four days to the top And there's the test. First ever European group stage performance for us. Let's go. Tempted to go with the defensive one and see if that's better, you know? I don't know. Or North America qualifying. More players getting removed from the shortlist. Hmm. Tom Pentra away. You know? Do we go with the attacking formation or the defensive one that seems to work better? Maybe we'll go with the defensive again and see. We should be beating Tom Pentra. Fabled right back, right wing combination of inward wing back and wide target man for Norway. <laughs> oh my days, they are big brain time. Five, five D, five D chess plays from Norway. Never mind, five at the back now. Okay, it was too much even for them to handle. <laughs> okay, um, right. New Goit triple tower at Silverham Midwest. Wins for those two, I assume. Oh, know with a big win over Haverford West. That's not what we want. Thurdino's our, our rival here. Euro Cup television coverage, 8K. You'd love to see it. Other than this save, what's the best FM save you've ever done? Um, ooh, that's a good question. Uh, I did an FM 14 Afan Lido save where I got into the semifinals of the Champions League. Uh, that was pretty good. Um, I also I did a Pentagon in FM 15. That was pretty good. I completed it. Um, I also, to be honest, my FM 21 save was pretty good. The one with Salgueiros. What I did for the achievement chaser one, like got from the fourth division of Portugal to winning the Champions League and won the World Cup with Brazil. Like, it's not, that's not a bad save. Uh, at least making changes now. <laughs> Extra time now. Ah, okay. Uh, Zanetti take on Tom Pentra. All right. Get the same assistant. So, yeah, probably one of those two, I'd say. I didn't really, I to, honestly, like since the 15 one, I don't have many like big saves because this is the save, you know? I had a, I, I had a, um, also, to be fair, one of my crowning achievements was my network save where I got Macclesfield from the Vanara Conference to the Championship in like six years, five years, something like that. Um, injuries, so now it's 5 3 1. For some reason, saw the striker is playing his DM. Oh, God. On V beat Newtown. Okay. So if you just did this straight from when you started and just play this save when you played FM, where do you think you'll be if that makes sense? See, if you just 
did this straight from when you started and just played this save when you played FM? Where do you think you would be if that made it beat? Um, I don't, well, I don't know. I probably have a, maybe an extra 50 years in. Because I didn't play that many extra saves, you know? Like, maybe, maybe I'd have an extra 30 to 50 seasons. I don't think it would be that significant. Because I didn't really, like, I played a good bit of FM21. But, yeah, I don't think it would be, like, 100 seasons. I think it would be below 100 seasons. But still, uh, never mind. Now play. He's playing centre back. Get the height. He's just. He's the height there. You know. I. 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 As a. To be honest, as a striker, I've done the DM shift. I've done the centre back shift. I remember um, we were down to ten in a cup final, and from like the fucking thirteenth minute, we scored a penalty in like the eightieth. So I was a striker, and I went. I looked at the manager, and I went. I'm going to uh, go play def defensive midfielder now. And I went and played defensive midfielder. And I've also moved back to centre-back to go three at the back because I'm, I am I played centre-back and striker. So I can do both. The Akron 3-1 at home. League 2 first game of the season. Nice. Never mind. No, okay. Still nil-nil second half extra time. Okay. I remember I was doing a Spurs save in 22 or something. I was playing Chelsea in the, the Club World Cup. I had like 10 injuries that game. Finished the game with six players. I lost on pens. Blackburn and Athlone Town. Oh my god, we can actually send players out on loan to one of these two. Wow. Um, oh, wow. Okay, interesting. Blackburn would be very cool. But then I just get English recruits. Ireland? You know what? I'll, I'll recommend Ireland. I'll get Irish. Like, look, we want Wales to do well, but we also want Ireland to do well. Because I just want the home nations to do well, not England, you know. Uh, but why play a striker at centre when you have three centre-backs on the pitch? One centre-back is playing DM. What is he cooking? Who knows? Maybe the centre-back's a better DM than Tor than Torloth is, you know? <laughs> okay, right. Um, let's see. Tom Pentra now. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Match preview. So we are gonna, I think we'll go over the defensive one to start with. Right, I'm going to bed now. Good night, Jambo. Have a good evening, man. See you a later point. In fairness, we, we made it to pens. Exactly. Exactly. Jesus Christ. Athlete would have scored 10, conceded 10. Port Talbot have st had a stonking start. Right. They want Inara up there. Klaus, Malasevich, Lockwood, Kovacic. Okay. Dal. Wayne Griffiths. Sergio Gomez. Um, Manalov. Shane Doyle, Doyle. I need a D. I need a someone here. Passage. I want pause out. <laughs> okay, I guess we we'll just go with that. I think we've got to train pause to be a DM. Maybe is he training to be a DM? No, he's training to be a DM, mate. All right. Made it, man. I'm sorry for doubting Soul Bark and Harlan misses. Oh no, not a good start there. Right, I think we, we'll go with this, and we'll see how we go versus um, Tom Pentra away here. Um, bump that up. Move that to 2D. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Uh, we are favourites here. We'll see how things go. Oh, dear God. What, what's... What, uh, what, okay, um, okay, here we go. Let's see if this plays a bit better. Maybe a bit more... Uh, even though it's more defensive, it allows for more openings, you know? Mir on the ball. Kirilla. Okay. 3-1 at the moment. To who? Croatia. Kirilla. Christ, mate. Jesus. Jesus Christ, mate. Okay, he's fouled eventually. <laughs> Inara on the free kick. Go on, go on, Inara. Oh, it's the wall. Inara again. Klaus is there. Lockwood. 3-2 after 3 each. Croatia. Ah, I see. Okay. Cameron. Need a Croatia miss then. Mir. Okay, 15 minutes in. Nothing much happening. Okay, another throwing cover chick. Lockwood. Cameron. Sorensen on a yellow already. Malasevic. Klaus gone. Oh, what is happening? What is going on? How has that not got in? What was going on there? If Breivik misses, we lose. Ooh. Oh, goodness me. What the hell happened there, man? Inara free kick. Sorensen. Kovacic. Lockwood. Get out for a corner. Goal. Okay, still in it. Need a Croatia miss. Inara plays it in. What doesn't meet the first man? Sack him. Um, okay. Goodness. 
Mr. Bonds, well done, Cameron. Half an hour in, still nil-nil. Hmm. We haven't been playing that good. Croatia score all five. Ah, unlucky. Unlucky, man. Okay, Malasevich loses out there. Via. Um, Jesus Christ, that's a bit fucking audacious, mate. <laughs> a bit fucking audacious, that. Jesus. Okay, Lockwood, Inara. We've had all the highlights so far, but only two shots on target. Oh, there's Valencia, our former boy. Uh, winning the ball, actually, and starting a move for them to nearly score. Bloody hell, lads. That was the chance of the game. <sighs> hmm. Maybe, that, maybe Newtown are just terrible, which is why we smashed them. Because everyone else, this formation is not working so good against. Kovacic, Klaus, Lockwood, Malasevich, Klaus, Lockwood. Lockwood, man, you got to do better from that position, man. Nara's got a 6.4. Austria in the quarters, though, knocking out host USA. Ooh, big. Maris with a big save. Harland, of all people, misses. <laughs> right. Hmm. So, I'm far from pleased. We're going to go more attacking. I'm going to bring Nara back to there. Put him there. Bring on Passage. Passage. Um, Malasevich for Vidal. Give him his debut. There we go. Oh, brilliant. Another, another injury. Hmm. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, immediate injuries. Acuna's going to play there because we don't have another right winger. Wait, who is... Who is why is Cameron playing there? Why, why does it swap players around like that? And they've injured another player. Acuna's now injured. He's just come on. Fucking hell, Rhett. Fucking hell, man. And the highlights are flying away. Come on, boys. Let's get a goal, please. It's bloody Tom Pentra away. This is not looking good for us in our our uh, formation. <laughs> you know, Newtown was just shit, obviously. Oh, my God. They're going to score. What a save, Maris. Fucking hell. They've actually played better than us in this game as well. Hmm. Yeah, switch to this one and then go attacking. Okay, this might be better. Not good though for us. We are we we are struggling versus teams that are terrible that we would win easily. Like past past times, Massage into the wall, shoots wide again. They put the ball again. Well done, Inara. Good tackle, but it just just falls back to them. Okay, Inara, go on. Klaus. I think Burnley are giving me the job. Hey, nice. Oh, fucking El Passage. Wilkins, Agangel, Valensas, Abadie, Goodwin, Chirilla, Passic, Vidal, Lockwood, just terrible shot. Acuna gets a corner at least. Can't decide, kind of want to stay. Ooh, but it's a journeyman, you know? One of those ones. I get how much money they're offering you compared is a, is a big one, because I guess if it's realistic, you'd probably go for the money, wouldn't you? Like, move to a big job, Burnley, you know? Passage, get your name known in England. Oh, poor, poor. Gorilla win. Oh, fucking hell. We're actually going to draw against Tom Pentra here. Fucking hell, man. We're shit. We're fucking shit this year. I don't know what's happened. God, I thought the formation was going to work, but it's just not working at all. Ugh. Fuck's sake. And draw with Tom Pentra away. Aggressive. Like, what is going on with everybody? I don't know, man. Not been offered a contract yet. They are requesting backroom staff changes. Oh, okay. It's very fucking annoying. Another, another draw. I just... I don't know. I don't know if this is... It's just not working at the moment. Not working. Maybe play wider. Go with that. Kunya injured and Kovacic. Two to three months for Kovacic. Ugh. Ugh. Hurts. Uh, right, well, Vitesse up next. That's going to make things easier. And then the... Oh, yeah, now we've got the six games versus the big six. Fantastic. Fantastic news, lads. Just... Just what I wanted to hear, you know? Just what I wanted to hear. Fuck's sake. Ugh. Okay. Um, right. 
gym teacher doesn't want me to join me at Burnley. <laughs> oh no. Right. Hmm. I guess maybe we could put wingers in instead. We're going to go wider now, you know? We could put these guys as, as wingers. Go pick it real quick. Put you as a ball winning midfielder and you as a deep line playmaker. Maybe that'll allow for a bit better. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> you gotta just start trying stuff now, you know? Okay, come on then. Let's go. Vitesse at home. this um right okay well done Lee barry by the way winning versus mets there big win so if, wait, if, they've, if they've asked you for staff stuff doesn't that mean they're offering you the contract or is that is it different now in fm 24 or 23 or 22 whichever one you're, one you're playing so conflicted Asman also doesn't want to <laughs> do you have to ask them whether they come with you or something first coin okay passage wants first team football sure mate right let's go I feel like it's clicking at the moment, which is weird because it clicked it so well in that Newtown game. Maybe it, I hate click that chance, but Newtown was just terrible, it seems. Mm. Okay, game day. Told Burnley I wanted to adjust the stuff, but my staff don't want to move to Burnley. <laughs> Too right, you know, moving from Portugal to Burnley, you know. Right, here we go. What do they want? I want a Nara there. I don't think we want a Nara there. Let's put Passage there. Let's put Nara up there because I think Lockwood's had a poor couple of games. Um, Mikanovic, Meyer, Yedlika, Perif, Kronzberg, and Gessen. I don't think Gessen is good in that role. Perif. Okay, let's go with that. Yeah. We're going, going for it, you know? No loyalty from my gym teacher, shake my head. <laughs> Uh, okay, so they're playing a fucking weird formation too. So we're going to see how this stacks up, lads. Right, first ever champion... Uh, sorry, Champions League. Europa League game. Off we go. Us versus uh, Vitesse. Oh, goodness. Everything's a bit big. Pull that over. Pull that over. Um, we're in the blue, interestingly. Um, and they're in the yellow, which confused me a little bit to start with. Um, okay, and they've already got chances, which is not what you want to see. Um, Lima, Cruz, Trevino. Great save, Maris. He's offside, though. Thank God. Okay, chance for us. Passage. Perif. Set pieces. FC. Acuna with a big save, though. Do I go to the Premier League or do I stay and play Europa League? That's the question. Who's offering more money, you know? Rebecca Reputation. It's not my decision to choose. Milan take the lead versus Rubin. We're not... We've not started well here, either. Lima. Maris with a big save. Right. It's time to swap things up already I think you go to that um, I'm close down much more stone for you to go with that because that wasn't working Ireland in the court as Netherlands out oh damn huge upset huge upset my goodness Cameron well done in Nara Costa neck Nara Perif Nara Passage on Passage Perif Inara, Cameron, Ostenek, Inara. There's a shot off that goes out for a corner. Okay. 
Passage plays it in, cleared at the back post. Oh no. Are they going to get something out of this? Well done, Perif. Nearly 10 times wages, though. Almost have to take it. That's, yeah, you probably would, I guess, even if it's going to be no Europe, you know? Because that is wild, especially getting your name known in England, you know? Bond Klaus, Costa Neck. Oh, just runs into the box. Hi, right, Jake. What are you doing, mate? Okay, we've been much better since we switched to the more defensive formation, actually. So we're going to stay as is. Perif, great ball. Passage, can you put it across? Klaus! 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 With his first ever goal for us in the Euro group stages. Goes to Klaus. You'll have to see it. Go on, Passage. Pulls it back. Well done, and Klaus is there to finish, and that's 1 0 for Nethi. My player team was a big target man. He wants to join me. <laughs> Play the Burnley way. Okay, Passage. What are you doing, Jake? Have a sniff around. Oh, God. AC Milan are winning 6 0 over Rubin. Right, half time, we're 1 0 up. Happy with the performance so far. Keep it up. Passage, Inara. Bosniak. Oh, of course, Passage is injured now. Of course, of course. Um, right, I guess Inara is going to go play defensive winger. And Lockwood's going to go play out there. Or he asks, asks for one game and then he gets injured in it. Trevino injured. Cameron. Malasevich. Been very quiet. Inara, pull it back. Oh my god, how's he saved that? How has that, how? How has that been saved? How is he saving all of these chances, man? Oh my days. How well... Uh, Will Germany do in the Euros as hosts? They just keep losing to friendlies. They're going to do terribly because they're pretty bad now and they don't have good quality, I don't think. When you're playing Havertz at left back, it's not going to work. They might get through to the knockouts, but I think they're going to... Because it's quite easy to get through the knockouts in Euros. But I think there's a, there's a, a very a big upset a, a exit coming for them. Um, 35. Oh, goodness me. That's a great ball. Oh, my God. How's that not gone in? Fucks. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it as soon as he did it. Fuck's sake, Anar. What is wrong with you? How we were literally like somehow unable to score that goal, and then they were going to give them a penalty. <sighs> Probably beat England. Honestly, it's, it's, a, it's a shit off at the moment. But if I care about it, it's an insane amount when you think it, it, it really is. It really fucking is. It's crazy amount. Don't concede. Don't lose now. We were so good. We were doing so well, and suddenly we're just lose. What's, what's happened to us? It feels like we've just. There's like a switch, and suddenly we just stop playing well. Oh, I just can't believe we didn't score that goal, and then they've equalised it like that. Malasevich into the box. Poor shot in the end. It's a weak shot. Did you know Will still doesn't have his coach, so we just have to play a fine replace with his fancy and burn lead. <laughs> okay. Come on, boys. Ball in. Pal oh, how is that blocked? Like, genuinely, how is that blocked on the line like that? It's fucking ridiculous. I just don't... Oh, come on, man. I just... Uh, oh, my God. Klaus. Five clear-cut chances this game. Five. Fantastic. Like, it's just... The players just can't score at the moment, it seems. They just can't score. Cameron just loses it. Perif. Maybe it's not the formation. It's just players just getting used to new roles, maybe. But I just... Like, the, the strikers shouldn't be. They're playing this exact same roles. It's just five clear-cut chances to their two. And they've just got a penalty and scored it. Bye-bye, Chavez. Sack him. <laughs> ah, so annoying. So annoying. We get a point, but it's not good enough, you know. We should have been winning that. Ugh. Well, then. First Europa League game ends in a draw due to a penalty given away. Very annoying. And passage injured. Ugh. Port Tabba did well, though. And so did AC Milan. Very well. Um, what about... Barry beat Copenhagen 8-0. Bloody hell. Yeah, this formation just doesn't seem conducive to us scoring lots of goals, which is a problem, I think. But, I don't know. We'll have to go into the sort of vault and have a little look. We got 80 gay for getting the draw there. Oh, well. Right, well, I think we're going to end it there for tonight. Not the best. Oh, God, we haven't lost one in four games. God damn, man. How do we beat FC Ists and then lose? Like, like gee, we've scored two goals in four games. Not looking good, lads. Not looking good. Well, then.
We're going to end it there for tonight. I'll be back at some point. I've got to get in the lab and get the tactic cooking up. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll see you guys on Thursday. I don't know when we're gonna, what we're going to be back for, but uh, hopefully we're in a bit of better spirits. Um, yeah, everyone have a good midweek. Hopefully see you Thursday or Saturday. So yeah, have a good one, everyone. See all of you later. Bye.